Let's us appreciate it, our special father, Apostle Meshakilu Kamakofi Mazuri. Hallelujah. We are to appreciate the grace upon our mom, Pastor Susan. Hallelujah. Finally, appreciate your good neighbor. Mtu ambayo mekana, I am appreciate. Hallelujah. Mama 
Kofi Mazuri. God bless you so much, our viewers all over the world. I can see you. Stanley Kingo, I can see you. Purity Moli, I can see you. Uh, Purity Moli, yes, we are Nemesham Taja. All of you tuning in, Dennis Mulua. God bless every one of you. Please, as you tune in, share the broadcast. Let us know where you are getting us from. Pia tuambia unatupata na mnagani. Is the sound okay and God is going to bless us. Kama kawaida yetu, kabla tujaanza ibada, uwa tunatengeneza madhabao. Kwa hivyo, ni masaya kunguza madhabao na sadaka zetu. Inua sadaka yako mtu mahali ulipo. Sema buwana yesu. Buwana yesu. Hii ni sadaka yangu ya madhabao. Hii ni sadaka yangu. Ninapo chochea haya madhabao. Ninapo chochea haya madhabao. Ninaomba njambo jipe itendeke kwa maisha yangu. Ninaomba njambo jipe itendeke kwa maisha yangu. Na kila madhabao ya mashetani. Na kila madhabao ya mashetani. Ya uchawi. Ya uchawi. Ya uganga. Ya uganga. Mandevo worshipa. Mandevo worshipa. Madhabao za kifamilia. Madhabao za kifamilia. Ninazo katani kikutumikia. Ninazo katani ukanibariki na ukanitumia zaidi katika jina la Yesu Kristo ukaipokea sadaka yangu na baba wa mbinguni kakupendeze kwa jina la Yesu Kristo nimeomba na nimeamini sema amen basi kama umeomba haya maombi namba ya simu ndio hiyo wale tuko hapa kanisani naweza nguza madhabahu hapo na sadaka yako wale wanataka mpesa namba ndio hii hapa ukisha tuma hapo utaona jina mesha kilu na hapo utajua imeshafika Kings Love Ministry na Mungu wa hii madhabahu atakwenda kukutenda mema katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Fesas Musimi God bless you so much. Mkristo asiye na madhabahu a believer without an altar is a powerless believer. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Mabebo yakifukuzwa panda ile na kunyanga kuland kwake. Aha. Uh -huh. Kwa hivyo akiwa na madhabahu na ana service kupitia sadaka zake itakuwa inakuja inakuta hapa kuna moto. Aha. Uh -huh. Alafu inapita na kuombe upokee kuwa na neema ya madhabahu katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Sema amina. Amina. Please you can sit and but don't sit on your mouth. Usikalie kinywa chako wala masikio. Uh, maana Mungu anakwenda kutubariki sana. Tumekuwa na ma, ma, mafundisho mazito sana tangia I think the beginning of this month. Uh, this is our third week dealing with otters. And I want to believe God has been helping us. Amen. Amen. Nataka niamini Mungu amekuwa akitusaidia wale tuko kule kwa mitandao nyumbani na wale tuko hapa. Uh, it's good. Uh, wakati tunaendelea ku kubiri pale na kuongea nanyi mnatufahamisha vile mafundisho haya yamekuwa yakiwasaidia ama yakiwabariki na Mungu wa mbinguni atakwenda kupokea utukufu. God bless you. Uh, Pastor Israel sadaka yako imefika kupitia Mpesa. Neema ya Bwana ikutoshe na madhabahu haya kutetea na ya kulinde. In Jesus precious name. Amen. Na leo hii kwa sababu tuna dina ota versus otas. Ni madhabahu ya Yesu Kristo, madhabahu ya Kaivali inakabiliana na madhabahu zingine za mashetani. Amen. 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 Na tukakubaliana ya kwamba madhabahu ni it is a center of transactions between spiritual realm and physical realm. Hapo mm -hmm. ndio huwa kuna mabandilishano ya vitu. Mungu ni roho Shetani ni roho. Bwana mm -hmm. Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Na hizi falme mbili maandiko inasema Matthew chapter 11 verse number 12. Since the days of John the Baptist until now the kingdom of God has been suffering violence mm -hmm. and the violent take it back by force. Uh -huh. Sasa the violence that we are using maana tunajua maandiko inasema vita vyetu sio mwili na damu lakini ni vita za kiroho. Sasa wale wata fanikiwa kuteka nyara vitu ambao zimeibiwa na shetani ni wale wanaelewa madhabahu sema madhabahu madhabahu god bless you so much eh, winifred kwa sababu ya sadaka yako kupitia mpesa neema hii kubebe kupatie kitu kipya siku ya leo katika jina la yesu amen nalea kunguza madhabahu mahali ulipo maana mkristo asiye na madhabahu atakuwa mkristo wa amina isiyo na matokeo atakuwa mkristo wa maombi isiyo na results lakini mkristo anaelewa maombi na sadaka huyo mtu ataenda mbali sana. Amen. Na kuombea upokee neema hizo vitu mbili. Amen. Sema neema. Neema. Ya madhabahu. Ya madhabahu. Na matoleo. Na matoleo. Iwe juu yangu. Iwe juu yangu. Kwa hivyo wakati tunaongea kuhusu altar versus altars, ni madhabahu ambao ni Yesu Kristo aliinua kupitia umwagaji wa damu pale msalabani. Na altar vita za madhabahu huwa zinapigana na madhabahu wengine. Mhm. Mm kuna vita ya mapepo hiyo nayo tutaikaunda attack tutumia the spirit of god mm -hmm. kuna ma, ma, ma vita ya wachawi 
maana mchawi na mganga ni kuani wa shetani uh-huh. nasi tutakapoona wanatuinukia tutamwendea mchungaji ama kuani wa Mungu apigane na mchawi uh-huh. bwana Yesu apewe sifa Amen. lakini ikifika kwa madhabao sasa tunawacha hata mchungaji tutamweka kando anatuonyesha njia kidogo alafu anatufundisha njizi ya kuinua madhabao tubomoe ile ingine uh-huh. Mungu akamwambia Gideoni enda kwa nyumba ya baba yako maana kuna madhabao ya baali chukua faali wawili wa kwanza bomoa hiyo madhabao faali wa pili jenga madhabao because it's a battle between altar and altars amen i pray for somebody in the name of jesus uh-huh. may this revelation change your life in jesus name amen so today i want to bring another topic by the grace of god ambao inaitwa breaking altars of sex amen 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 breaking altars of sex madhabao ya ngono mhm Amen. Amen. Na kama wewe ni mwanadamu na unamasikia unisikize vizuri. Uh-huh. Maana tuko na kazi nyingi sana ya kufanya. Amen. Haleluya. Amen. Na kila mtu aliye hapa, maana hapa sioni mtoto mdogo. Uh-huh. Anaelewa hiyo kitu nasema. Any time mtu anajiunga kimapenzi na mwingine. Uh-huh. Huwa wanatengeneza madhabao. Uh-huh. Amen. Amen. Ukiangalia from the beginning of the Bible Genesis all the way to Revelation anywhere there was bloodshed there was an altar aha uh-huh. mahali popote pali mwagika damu pali kuwako na madhabao uh-huh. number 2 pali kuwako na covenant haleluya amen so any time a man meets a woman there is an altar and there is a covenant amen na tulisema ya kwamba madhabao ni mahali mtu anayesafungwa ama akafunguliwa. Aha. So kuna watu hata tukawaombea miaka mingapi unless we address the altar of sex. Huyo mtu hata wewe uachiliwa. Aha. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Maana mtu yoyote alilalana na yeye walitengeneza madhabao na wakaweka agano. Mm-hmm. Leviticus 17 verse 11 nasemaje. Itakuwa hivyo maana uwai wa kila kiumbe huko katika damu. Kwa hivyo mwanadamu mwanamke na mwanaume wanapokutana there is exchange of blood. Uh-huh. That exchange of blood is is a union of souls. Uh-huh. Ni makutano ama ni, ni kushikana kwa nafsi. Mhm. Uwai wa mwanadamu unaingia kwa mwanaume unaingia kwa mwanamke na uwai wa mwanamke unaingia kwa mwanaume. Kwa hivyo hao watu wanakuwa kitu kimoja. Uh-huh. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Najaribu kuleta introduction ndio uone kile tuna deal nacho siku ya leo. Alafu tutaingia kwa maombi makali hapa. Maana kuna wanaume wanakufua tanga. Aha. Maana haukutenganishwa na wao kupitia madhabao. Amen. Kuna wanawake wananifua tanga, maana mimi nilifikiria ni mchezo tu tunacheza, niishie hapo lakini haikuisha. Aha. Kuna madhabao tulijenga na maagano bado iko. Amen. Nguza mtu mwambie leo hii. Leo hii mambo yanakwenda kubadilika. Mambo yanakwenda kubadilika. God bless you purity muli kwa sababu ya sadaka yako katika hii madhabao. And I pray in the mighty name of Jesus every altar holding your life through sex it is going to break by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So watu wengi ambao unaona siku hizi wako katika ndoa na ndoa zina matatizo. It is because they ignore the issue of a boyfriend and a girlfriend. Mm-hmm. Anafikiria unajua sasa nilioa mimi sina ushirika na huyo girlfriend na sina ushirika na huyo boyfriend lakini kuna mkataba waliingia Bwana Yesu asifiwe Amen Kuna mkataba waliingia wakati walilala pamoja kuna madhabao iliinuka Aha Na any time Mungu anamtazama anaona ni kweli yako na bibi mmoja lakini spiritually kuna wawili wengine alilala nao akiwa high school Aha Na hawajawahi tenganishwa ndio maana unaona most of the believers atuna baraka kwa sababu uh-huh. gani baraka zetu they are being shared to a non people aha uh-huh. zinaingia kwa anga zinaenda na huyo Zina, zinaletanga kitu inaitwa soul tie mm-hmm. soul tie uh-huh. somebody say soul tie soul tie so many people have been arrested through soul tie through sex that is the greatest weapon of the enemy uh-huh. hiyo anatumianga kuangusha watu aha uh-huh atakutavuta kupitia sex. Ukikosa hiyo hautakosekana ya tamaa ya pesa. Aha. Amen. Amen. Kwa hivyo ni vitu shetani ameweka strategically 
who fight those who are in the kingdom of God. But my prayer is that anybody listening to me, uh-huh. you are going to be delivered in Jesus' name. Amen. I say God is going to deliver you in Jesus' name. Amen. Any single blessing that you lost, in the name of Jesus. So, Mwanadam Pia Akona Vitu Tatu, Akona the soul, Akona the body, and Akona the spirit. So, Matendo ya sex uwe ina affect the body, the spirit, and the soul. Uh-huh. Amen? Amen? Kuna kitu unaeza fanya ikose ku affect soul yako. Uh-huh. Kuna dhambi unaeza fanya ikose ku affect spirit yako. Uh-huh. Ama mwili wako. Lakini, when it comes to sex, it will arrest the spirit, the soul, and the body. Mm-hmm. Amen. And that's why we have the Trinity in the kingdom of God. We have God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. Amen. So, manadamu wa metengenezo na hizo vitu tatu. Kwa hivyo, moja ikiwa affected, huyu mtu atakuwa weak automatically. Mm-hmm. Sema buwana Yesu nisaidi. Buwana Yesu nisaidi. Na katika soul, diyo kuna vitu na izitanga emotions za mtu. Diyo kuna intelligence ya mtu. Aha. Uh-huh. Ndiyo kuna feelings za mtu. Ndiyo kuna passion ama will ya mtu. Emotions. Feelings. Intelligence. Na will. Kuna kitu kimoja mungu wa metuachia. A very precious thing in our lives. Inaitangwa will. Do you know ukiwa umeokoka na uchuse kutookoka. Mungu hata kusuilia. Because that is your will. You have chosen that. Uh-huh. Mtu akizaliwa akiwa mzuri na amue kuwa mtu mbaya, Mungu atamwacha tu. Aendelea kufanya that maana ni will yake. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. Amen. Si mtu leo aamue I will make a decision and I will I'm ready I'm willing to be delivered from this kind of demonic orders. Uh-huh. Na hiyo uamuzi yako Mungu ataiheshimu na ataitimiza siku ya leo. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hebu tuende kitabu cha 1 John, not 1 John but John John chapter 4, verse 16 to 19. God bless you, Bernice, kwa sababu ya sadaka yako. Hii madhambao ikufungue na any evil altar affecting your destiny in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Amen. Johanna kifungu cha ine, sari wa kumina sita, tuende mpaka kumina tisa. Yesu haka muambia, nenda kamuita mmeo. Ukirudi hapo nyuma, Yesu hame kutana mwanamuke uyu, musamaria ama musamaritan katika kisima cha Yakobo na wakaanza majadiliano hapo akamwambia mwanamke nipe maji hai akamuuliza mimi na wewe hatutangamani wewe ni Muyahudi mimi ni Musamaritani sasa kulingana uh, traditions za huku hatufai kutangamana i'm not supposed to eat mingi with you uh-huh. so kukawa na mjana la like, ikaendelea ikaendelea ikafika mahali ika, ikafika mwisho Sasa Yesu wakaanza kuongea na huyu mwanamke kiunabi. Sasa hapo ndiyo tumeanzia, nimefanya kukati shot ndiyo tuflo araka raka. Ehe, tuendele. Yesu wakamuambia. Yesu wakamuambia huyu mwanamke. Nenda kamuite mmeo haja hapa, uje nae hapa. Enda, ukaite bwana yako na ukuje na ye hapa. Huyo mwanamke wakamuambia. Huyo mwanamke wakamuambia haji. Mimi sina mme. Mimi, unaniona hivi. Na kaa kuwa na mume, lakini sina mume. Yesu haka mwambia, uh-huh. umesema ukweli. Hapo umesema ukweli. Kwamba una mume. Uh-huh. Maano umekuwa na wame watano. Yesu haka anza kumwambia, now, saa hii hauna mume. Na wale wanakuwa na wanasema huja olewa. Lakini you have been having five men. Umekuwa na wanaume watano. Na hakuna mtu wanawajua ni weo unawajua. Mm-hmm. Na hata yule ukonaye saa hii hata na ye, pia si wako uh-huh. munafanyanga munakutana mahali munafanya na munawachana uh-huh. Lakini when i see you woman i'm seeing you being married by many men Aha uh-huh. Anaisa Amen Hapo ndio kuna kuanga na kizungumkuti watu uh-huh. wengine tuko hapa tukafunguliwa macho <laughs> uone wale watu wako nyuma yetu my uh-huh. friend utawai tusikiza Haleluya Amen Amen. Kanisani unaonanga msichana akibeba mimba anafukuzwa. 
anatolewa praise and worship ama hapo lakini mwenye hiyo mimba amebaki tu hapo anarukaruka na si wa kwanza huyo kijana ako na wengine saba nyuma aha na yule mnajaribu kuwekelea si yeye aha naomba Mungu leo atufungue macho kiroho amen tuangalie ni wanaume wangapi wanakufuata aha ni wanawake wangapi wanakufuata aha alafu tuwatoe hapo nyuma yako ndio Mungu akija aingie na baraka kwako amen kama uko tayari kuvunja hiyo madhabahu sema fire fire sema otas of immorality otas of immorality sexual otas sexual wherever you are wherever you are lose me by fire lose me by fire in the name of jesus in the name of jesus So Yesu akamwambia umekuwa na wanaume watano mwanamke akastuka aja wewe sikia pastor anaweza mwelezea hivyo na this woman was a church goer she was a prayer warrior maana hapo chini anaambia Yesu unasema nini sisi tumekuwa tukiombea kwa huyu mlima uh-huh. we usually come here as a church and we fast and we make prayers here uh-huh. so alikuwa mlokole alikuwa mama wa maombi wa kufunga na kuomba lakini kuna madhabao uh-huh. ya immorality uh-huh ilipidi mtu akuje na revelation kama hii ya leo Amen. mama akafunguliwa Amen. si mtu akuwe tayari siku ya leo tuvunje hiyo madhabahu maana kama hatutaongelesha hiyo madhabahu maro machafu haitawacha kututembelea haleluya sema my father my god my father my god deliver me from this altar deliver me from this altar in the name of jesus in the name of jesus endelea Yesu akamwambia Akamwambiaje? Umesema kweli? Umesema ukweli. Kwamba una mume. Ehe. Maana umekuwa na wame watano. Ehe. Na hiyo naishi naye sasa si mume wako. Na hata yule uko naye saa hii sio mume wako. Hapo umesema kweli? Hapo umesema ukweli. Huyo mwanamke akamwambia. Huyo mwanamke akajua kabisa. Hii mambo mimi nimekuwa nimeficha miaka mingi sana. Na kama huyu mtu ameyaona huyu Huyo mtu si wa kawaida endelea. Huyo mwanamke akamwambia. Akamwambiaje? Bwana, mm. naona ya kuwa wewe unabii. Yaani mimi nimekuja ku notice wewe si mtu wa kawaida. Mm. Wewe ni nabii. Maana haya mambo nani amekuambia? Unajua siku ya leo kuna madhabahu tutafichua ndani yako. Amen. Inaitangwa madhabahu fiche ya immorality. Aha. Alafu tutaivunja kuivunja. Amen. Na maisha yako yatakombolewa in Jesus name. Amen. Nimekuja na upako wa kiunabii. Aha. Na mafuta ya kimitume pia. Amen. Madhabahu ya sex. Aha. Nasema altars of immorality. Aha. They must break by fire. Fire. In the name of Jesus. Kwa hivyo akamwambia wewe unabii mambo haya vile umeyaleta mimi sijakuambia lakini vile umeniletea mpaka nikaona mm. you are a true prophet amen somebody say amen amen madhabahu haya huwa inaingia hivi for example ile familia umetoka imekuwa ni familia ya watu wa they, they believe in marine powers ama wako na majini aha amen amen huyo ni kijana kwao kuna majini hiyo they have otters from marine powers. Aha. Na anaenda na kukutana msichana kule high school. Wanaingia boyfriend na girlfriend. Naye msichana kule ametoka kwao kuna uganga. Aha. Jose yake ni mganga ama mama yake ni mganga. Kwa hivyo wanakuja wanalala pamoja. Aha. Wanaweza wasifiwe? Amen. Sasa kijana wa madhabahu ya manjini ameingia kwa madhabahu ingine ya uchawi. Aha. Sasa ameingiza madhabahu zimekuwa mbili. Aha. Amen. Amen. Atoke hapo awachana huyo msichana aseme hata sikuwa nataka aina hiyo. Aende akutana mwingine kwao kuna laana. Aha. Alale na huyo msichana kwao kuna madhabahu ya laana. Ameingiza madhabahu ya tatu ndani yake maana uwai wa kiumbe uko katika damu. When they exchange that order has been established. Aha. Are we together? Yes. Na kila madhabao it is powered by a covenant. Kwa hiyo kama covenant ya msichana yule kwao ni laana, kijana ameingizwa kwa msururu wa laana. Aha. Haleluya. Amen. Nasema haleluya. Amen. Atoke hapo akutane na msichana mwingine. Kwao kuna madhabao ya polygamy. Aha. Wanawake kwao lazima waolewe bibi wa pili ama watatu. Aha. Yule kijana alitoka kwa madhabao ya majini akaingia ya uganga akaingia ya laana sasa amekutana nyingine ya polygamy ana, anatumbukizwa ndani aha na hiyo chini itaendelea unless ikuwe revealed na huyo mtu akombolewe hiyo mashetani itamwangaisha usiku na mchana aha ndio unasikia all, all all always 
Watu wanakuambia zile ndoto wanaotanga hata unashangaa. Oho. Pasa na watanga ni kilaliswa na nyoka. Unauliza how? Si kupenda kwa is a collection of altars of immorality. Aha. Si mezaa kifo. Masi, mani kwa masi ya na hii ya yebu. Isi ya achau. Isi ya akiku. So a collection of a, a sin which according to you is a small sin. And another small sin. And another small sin. At the end of the day, it will kill your destiny. Uh-huh. It will kill your great ministry. Uh-huh. It will kill your great gift. Uh-huh. Some will say, oh, tars of immorality. How tars of immorality. You must lose me by fire. You must lose me by In fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let's go to Numbers 25, verse 1 to 4. Esabu. 25, verse 1 to 4. Mungu anachukia immorality. Mungu anachukia Eh, mambo ya, ya mapensi kando ya ndoa Mungu hayapendi Nimesoma andiko Kitabu cha Leviticus chapter 21 verse 7 ikanishangaza sana Muhubiri kwa sababu wa ubiri kuna wabiri uwa kuna wabiri uwa uwa wanaoa ama wanaolewa Na kitu kinatokea tu either bibi anaaga ama bwana anaanga. Alafu ana choose kuoa kwa sababu miaka ni midogo. Mm-hmm. Amen. Amen. Unajua kuna zile sheria Mungu amepeana mtu kama atafanya hivyo. Amesema Leviticus 21 verse 7 kama kuani amewacha bibi ama amewachwa na bibi yake ama amewachwa na bwana yake na angependa kuoa asiowe a divorced woman or a divorced man uh-huh. amen amen now wakati anasema the, this divorced man kuna kitu Mungu anakinga kwa huyu mtumishi wake awe wa kike ama wa kiume maana akienda aoe mtu ambaye ni divorced ameingia tu another battle of altars of immorality uh-huh. amen kwa nini amen kwa anasema kama ataoa atafute mwanaume ambaye ni virgin ama mwanamke ambaye ni virgin aha hiki kizazi tuko saa hii utamtoa wapi wewe utatoa mtu virgin wapi hiki kizazi labda sijui uende taifa ambao haijaanza sababu ile ushetani imekuwa huko unaitwa safiu ile utamtoa wapi ni mchungaji mimi nataka kutumikia Mungu na inaona ni vizuri ni yao kwa sababu hii madhabao staki ikuje kuni attack nikiwa kwa huduma Sasa itabidi tu niangukie and divorce the girl somewhere maana kalikuwa na kijana juzi walioana Sisi ndio tunaonanga tunaenda pray tunasema walikuwa boyfriend na girlfriend lakini in the real sense they married Aha uh-huh. Amen Amen In real sense they married Kupigana madhabao ya polygamy sio kitu rais Vanessa Sfiu Amen It demands a lot of sacrifice Na ndiyo ukisoma hapo Hiyo nitakupatia assignment ukasome peke yako Leviticus 21 1 verse 1 Hiyo kifungu yote inaongea kuhusu Otas of immorality Uone mtu wakijipata kwa mutengo ya ina hiyo Atajinasua na muna gani Maana hiyo ni kazi kila mtu ananisikiza saa hii Tunaistaili kuifanya mm-hmm. Hata ukipuuza madhabao ingine Usipuuze hii madhabao na kufundisha leo Amen. Maana ime affect wengi Mimi nikiwa ndani Aleluya Maana inasumbua mpaka mambisho Inasumbua mpaka manabi Akiwa kijana mdogo Alizini Na kwa sababu alikuja akaokoka akiwa Over 18 Sasa nafikiria that issue was over It is not over uh-huh. It is not over It erected an altar Na madhabau kama ijavunjwa Bado inafanya kazi uh-huh. Inaendelea kutuma roho Sema my father, my God. My father, my God. Have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. And deliver me today. And deliver me today. Mungu wa kubariki Stanley Kingoko sabi ya sadaka yako watika hii madabao. Every altar speaking against your manifestation. It is going to crash in the name of Jesus. Amen. This is a man, Numbers 25 verse 1 to 4. Wazairi walipo kuwa uko shitimu. Uh-huh. Wanome walianza kuzina wanawaki wa mwa. Wa Israeli ni taifa ambao ni teule kwa mungu. He's a very precious Nation, a precious people before God. Lakini wakati moja wakiwa mahali panaitwa Shitim. Wanaume wa Israeli wakaanza kulala na wanawake wa Moabu. 
Moabites were undefiled people. Aha. Uh-huh. Moabites walikuwa wamezaliwa na mtu na mbindi yake. Aha. Uh-huh. Ndio wale walizaliwa na Lut na msichana wa kwanza na wa pili. Aha. Uh-huh. Bwana asifiwe. Amen. Kwa hivyo Muislamu anapoenda kulala na wanawake ambao uzao wao umetokana na baba kulala na msichana wao they are defiling the nation uh-huh. of Israel. Angalia mtu mwambie sex. Sex. Dangerous. Dangerous. Amen. Amen. Na ndiyo hiyo ndiyo kitu nilikwambia very dangerous. Hata kuku azipendi kushare wanawake. Mhm. Weka nzamba mbili hapa na miela tano. Utaona wameanza vita. Maana mm-hmm. they don't want to share. Aha. Uh-huh. Atafukuzwa yule wiki atapigwa mpaka uao. Uh-huh. Hata mbeberu ndenge ikiwa chuni na wewe hasina kulonga nyawa. Chuchua emu mara ndenge mwana kiotolwa. Uh-huh. They don't like to share. Uh-huh. Na hivyo ndivyo Mungu anatunza wale watu ambao anataka wabebe agano lake. Uh-huh. Anataka wabebe sanduku la agano his presence. Uh-huh. Some say my father my God. My father my God. I need your mercy. I need your mercy. So wana, wanaume wa Israeli wakaanza kulala na wa Moabu. Endelea. Wanawake hao uh-huh. wakawaalika wazeli washiki matabiko uh-huh. waliotabikia miungu yao uh-huh. na wazeli wakaa chakula uh-huh. na kuabudu miungu yao endelea ndivyo wazeli waliponjiunga na Mungu wa bahari wa peori uh-huh. na nayo asira ya Mwenyezi Mungu ikawaka dhidi yao walipoanza umesikia walipoanza kushiriki na wanawake wakaanza kuabudu miungu yao waliabudu aje Walienda kukula kwa madhabahu zao mm-hmm. waliposhiba wakaanza mapenzi. Uh-huh. Hivyo asira ya Mungu ikaanza kuwaka against the Israelites. Uh-huh. Na wakaanza kuinukua na maadui from every corner. Uh-huh. Kitendo kimoja cha ma, cha ngono cha mapenzi kando na ndoa kinaweza fungua ma, 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 mapepo milioni uh-huh. kwa mtu mmoja. Uh-huh. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Maana kimeenda kwa madhabahu you are bound to that altar. Yaani ume umeinamia hiyo madhabahu ya mashetani. Kwa hivyo any order you bow to it will give you whatever it carries. Aha. Madhabahu yote utainamia. Hiwe nzuri ama mbaya itakupa kulia kile imebeba. Aha. Kwa hivyo wale walipoenda kufanya hivyo na wakakula vyakula za hao wanawake wakakubaliana madhabahu zao. Aha. Ndio utaona mahali popote kutakuwa na sex. Kuna covenant it may sound a very simple one. Mm-hmm. Lakini unasikia ni, ni nunulie tu lollipop. Aha. itaingiza covenant. Aha. Amen. Amen. Ninulie tu chips itaingiza hiyo. Aha. Amen. Amen. Maana hiyo madhabahu ya huyo mtu imekulisha. Aha. Ikisha kukulisha itakukondro. Aha. Sema my father my God. My father my Have God. Have mercy on me. Have mercy. And on deliver me today. And deliver me from today. altars of immorality. From altars of immorality. Ukisikia mtu sauti iko chini ujue tumetuma kumhudumia tu na neema itamtosha. Amen. 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 Maana kuna mwanaume yako hapa kwa na mabibi kumi Aha. Kulingana wale alilala na wao. Aha. Hao wanawake kuna mwanamke yako hapa kwa na wanaume 22. Aha. Kulingana wale alifanya nini? Alilala na wao. Sisi kama tuko pamoja leo. Yes. First Corinthians 6 verse 18. Hatutakaa hapa sana lakini mafundisho haya tukiyachukua na tuyafanyie kazi na tumwambie Bwana we need your mercy. Amen. Hapa ndiyo tunahitaji neema kabisa hapa. Unajua maandiko inasema ya kwamba wakati amkuwa mnajua nilijifanya sijui makosa yenu. Mm-hmm. Lakini wakati mlijua sasa I started to judge you according to the truth that you know. Aha. Hallelujah. Amen. Now it will be a very big problem mtu kusikia message kama hii na anarudi huko huko. You will be punished times two. Aha. Because you know the truth and you have ignored the truth. Aha. Haleluya. Amen. First Corinthians chapter 6. Everyone's about 16. Maana kama mtu wapyo uh-huh. anayeungana kaaba uwa mwili mmoja naye. Mtu yeyote anayeungana na kaaba yeye huwa kitu kimoja na kaaba. Hiyo kuungana anasema matendo ya ngono mm-hmm. kulala pamoja. Ni wangapi tulilala na wao sisi hatukujua kama walikuwa kwa kazi ya umalaya. Aha. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Mimi sistui mtu naongea tuone mahali shida iko ndio tumuitishe Mungu huruma. Amen. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. 
Vinaweza kuwa ilifanyika lakini sasa hapo sio mwisho. Mungu anaweza tukamuita akatuonea huruma na ikatoka leo. Amen. Sema amina niendelee. Amina. So nasema mtu yeyote analala na kaaba, yeye na kaaba ni kitu kimoja. Aha. Sasa swali yangu ilikuwa ni wapi nilikutana maybe na msichana, mimi sikujua yeye ni kaaba tukalala pamoja sasa mimi najifanyanga nimeokoka kumbe mimi ni kaaba according to god aha i've been bound by that scripture aha nililala na kaaba kwa hivyo anywhere i appear that is not me god forbid siwezi nikafanya hivyo in jesus name so, anywhere i appear anywhere aha. you appear anaangalia naona kuna zapota nyuma yako aha endelea kama ilivyo andikwa aha nao wawili watakuwa mwili mmoja endelea lakini aliyejiunga na Bwana uh-huh. huwa roho moja naye. Endelea. Jebisheni kabisa na uzizi. Hapo ndiye anasema sasa, run away. Flee from immorality. It's not a case whereby we tutaanza kuwagiu. Unajua nilifanya, unajua silikufanya. Kama unajipata nilifanya, just flee away from it, never return back again. Amen. 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 Anasema utorokeni uzinzi run away from immorality aha kwa nini anasema tukimbie dhambi nyingine zote utendwa nje ya mwili dhambi zile zingine zote huwa zinatendwa nje ya mwili lakini mzizi utenda dhambi dhidi ya mwili wake mwenyewe lakini mzinzi lakini mzinzi ufanya dhambi kinyume na mwili wake mwenyewe mhm bwana yesu asifiwe amen there is no sin that drains anointing like sex aha uh-huh. amen amen Wewe unavunja hata confidence unakuwa ulikuwa unaendelea vizuri lakini tunaanza kuona hapa. Aha. Kuna kitu kilienda. Aha. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Mbona umecheka sana hapa ama <laughs> uliona practically mahali. Anasema zile zingine matusi hiyo ni nje. Lakini uzinzi Aha. inapiga roho, inapiga mwili na inapiga nafsi. Aha. Kwa nini unaonanga sometimes wale tunahudumu hapa? Sometimes unaona mtu tu hajaambiwa na mtu asikuje ibada mapema anachoose mwenyewe tu kukuja uh-huh. saa 5 ibada ikiwa imeanza. Aha. Uh-huh. Kuna kitu alifanya. Aha. Uh-huh. Haleluya. Amen. Kikaanza kulegeza ile tamaa yake kwa Mungu maana kuna kitu alifanya kikaumiza madhabahu yake. Aha. Uh-huh. Haleluya. Amen. Ministers bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Uliza mwanzangu ulichelewa siku gani? Ulichelewa siku gani? Maybe hiyo ndio ilikuwa sababu mimi ni kwasa mwambie bwana akusamee bwana akusamee maana zile zingine zina affect madhabahu lakini hii ina affect direct order uh-huh. ambao ndio huwa inapiga magoti kwa Mungu inainua mikono inasema wastaili yewe bwana lakini ikiingizwa pale nao kutoka itakuwa ngumu sana uh-huh. and i pray for somebody in the name of jesus amen any order of immorality aha uh-huh. today we are crushing it in jesus name amen tutaivunja kiasi ya kwamba haitawahi tengenezeka tena amen wa kwa mtandao mkisema fire si itendeke fire hapa kanisani ukisema fire si itendeke zaidi fire in the name of jesus run away from immorality In marriage everything else can be revealed but sexual immoral, immoral issues can't be revealed. Mhm. Amen. Nayo mapenzi ama ngono si mbaya. Aha. Kwa watu ambao wameoana. Aha. Kwanza hiyo nayo ukiingia na kuanga sheria. Aha. Utake na mwanzako ataki itabidi mkubaliane kwa sababu nayo inakuanga mutego kwa ndoa. Aha. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Kidogo tu niongee kama revelant although mimi si revelant. <laughs> Haleluya. Amen. Naongea chini ya mwongozo wa Roho Mtakatifu. Amen. Wale nao wameolewa. Shetani anajua. Wale wameolewa na kuona. Shetani anajua akinguza tendo hiyo muanze kunyimana nyinyi kwa nyinyi. Mlango itafunguka aende nje. Aha. The joke is mande commands yamu ikabata ni nywe kwa nywe. Aha. Haleluya. Amen. Ni maandiko. Kwa sababu sasa bibi akija mwambie bwana yake Monday nimechoka, Tuesday sitaki, Wednesday sitaki. Naye jamaa anaendelea kupamba mwili kona energy. Mm-hmm. He will be tempted to run. Maana amezoea, ameingizwa hiyo anga na amezoea. Aha. Wanandoa bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Mm-hmm. Na ndoa nyingi zile zinafunjika, shida inaanzanga tu hapo. Aha. Mimi nakuambia kama pastor Aha. Nimekaa hapa 
na, na mtumishi wa Mungu miaka sasa inaelekea kumi na, na kitu Mm-hmm. So I know the cases that we encounter about marriages. Uh-huh. Ukichunguza utapata shida ilikuwa hapo. Uh-huh. Maana shetani anatafuta vile ataweka polygamy hapo. Uh-huh. Huyu mtu aache bibi ama aache mke wake aende nje. Uh-huh. Apige mlango ipatikane. Uh-huh. Wanandoa Mungu atuonee huruma. Wanandoa wajasema amina tena. Sema my father my god. My father my god. Help me. Help me. To break orders. To break orders. Of immorality. Of immorality. Nani anasikia tunasaidika siku ya leo? Amen. Glory to God. Amen. Proverbs chapter 5 verse 20. Proverbs chapter 5 verse 20. Unajua madhabahu ya immorality. Ndio inashusha watu sana. Mm-hmm. Enda pale nje uwafuatilie wale secular musicians ambao ni famous mm-hmm. utawasikia na scandals za immorality. Uh-huh. Angalia tu. Wanaisha sifiwe. Amen. One good friend of mine aliniambia na hii nasema hata aliambia our special father. Alienda kukutana na one of the famous musicians in Kenya. Now the wakakaa tu akakaribiana Sasa akamwambia wewe si mtumishi wa Mungu unahubiri. Eh. Lakini ile ka fame uko nayo ni kidogo sana. Mimi nataka nikuonyeshe njia ya kuwa famous. Mhm. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Ah, pasa akamwambia sawa, twende niambie. Akamwambia sasa nataka nikupeleke mahali na tufanye vile nitakwambia. Utaamini vile huduma yako itanipuka. Akamwambia uh-huh. sawa twende. Unajua huyu jamaa walipokutana, unajua anamjua ni mwimbaji wa gospel, ni mzuri anaimbanga makanisa hata ile kubwa yote Kenya ama huyu akaimba kaambia sawa twende walipofika hapo akamwambia sasa itabidi utoe nguo ni wanaume wawili uh-huh. eh, ati nitoe eh za nini si umeniambia nataka kuwa famous kama mimi eh utembee huku Kenya yote eh hata upande ndege ndio sawa twende toa hai jamaa akamwambia nitoe eh si ni mwanaume mwanzangu akamwambia fame ni nataka nikudunge sindano za hii tu fame uingie Hai kaja mama akamwambia hii hii nayo siwezani nayo kakatoka mlangoni puka kaenda. Mhm. Ah wote unaona wame shoot. Hawa wengi wako na madhabahu ya immorality. Uh-huh. Nini kilifanya Suleimani kuwa famous? Many wives. Many wives anajulikananga na hiyo tu. Maana hiyo madhabahu shetani anaweza akakupatia fame lakini and destroy character. Uh-huh. Hello somebody Hello. Anaweza kupatia sifa nyingi sana lakini character yako anaharibu. Aha. Unawasikia anga huko kwa mitandao vile wanalimana. Wewe ulichukua so and so hata ulilala na so and so na wakopi wanaongeanga kama kitu ya kawaida. Maana they are being powered by the altars of immorality. Aha. Lakini siku moja unasikia hata wewe mwenyewe unasema kama hiyo nilikuwa nafuata wacha akae. Amevunjwa siku moja. That's how dangerous orders of immorality of immorality are. Aha. Naweza sikakuinua tu kisirisini, lakini zikifunuliwa zinakuweka chini. Mungu atusaidie katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Sema madhabahu ya ngono. Madhabahu ya ngono. Utavunjika siku ya leo. Utavunjika siku ya leo. Kwa hivyo hapa tunasoma huyu Sulaimani anaongea Proverbs chapter 5 verse 20. Anajaribu kuonya mtoto wake maana amekuja akangundua kwamba though I was a, a famous king, madhabahu hii imenipatia fame. Siwezi nikakubali mtu mwingine apitie hapo. Aha. Maana atakuwa anasoma vizuri na story inabadilika hapo mbele kwa sababu ya madhabahu mabaya. Aha. Sema Bwana Yesu nionee huruma. Bwana Yesu nionee huruma. Poli ni kioko mahali popote ulipo kwa sababu ya sadaka yako. Madhabahu inaongea kinyume na ndoa yako inavunjika ukisema fire. Fire. Haleluya. Amen. Hebu endelea. Mwanangu, kwa nini utaekwa na mwanamke mwesherati? Ya nini? Hebu kum... sema tena mwanangu uh-huh. kwa nini utekwa na mwanamke mwasharati uh-huh. ya nini kumkumbatia kumkumbatia kifuani mwanamke mgeni amen unajui morality inaanzanga very simple kwanza hiki kizazi tuko saa hii mm-hmm. lazima tukiombe na tukisaidie amen mimi tangu nizaliwe sijawahi atisalimia msichana kwa sababu tumeokoka bwana Yesu asifiwe alafu tunahaga msichana jesus christ Na ulizanga hiyo ni nini ananinguza nayo? Mhm. Anaweza asifiwe. Amen. Siku hizi hata unaona kijana mvulana ati wanakumbatiana hivi na maelfu kwa na babu wangu huyu. Hii. Na wameokoka. Hii mwili utajua tu. 
Mm-hmm. Itachemka ile siku nyingine mtakutana mkiwa wili alafu mfanye hivi. Kitamumwachani hiyo mikono dhambi ishaingia. Uh-huh. Anasema usikumbatie mwanamke mgeni. Wewe umekumbatia wangapi? Uh-huh. Ni madhabahu ulijenga. Uh-huh. That process kama ijakatwa inaendelea itazaa immorality. Aha. Uh-huh. Bana sasifiwe. Amen. Ponga mangonyo no maelogeza nasi. Bila na sahihi kwa na salimiana wasichana na wavulana hata wanaume. Bana Yesu asifiwe sana. Amen. Amen. Kukiwa na ngapo hapa. Aha. Uh-huh. Sasa hiyo yenu ya imekuja ya hivi hata kwa sababu umeenda chuo, uh-huh. unakuja na mambo ya chuo. Unajua western countries zimetuharibu. Zime Aha. Uh-huh. Mitindo ya Kiafrika hairuhusu hiyo. Aha. Uh-huh. Bana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Lakini ukiangalia movie ya Nigeria hata unafanya hapa sio Nigeria. Mm-hmm. Hapa ni Kenya my friend. Aha. Uh-huh. Haleluya. Amen. Hapa sio US, hata mnasalimiana hivi, unajua hata US m- mwanaume na mwanamke hata wa mwingine kusalimiana hata kwa madhabahu wanapeana hivi, haina shida. Mm-hmm. Wao wamelelewa hivyo. Lakini huku kwetu. Ay 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 ay. Sinishike huyu tu na bwana yake yako pale. Hiyo nyumba leo haitalalika. Aha. Maana hiyo hairuhusiwi huku. Aha. Atajijazia aseme ukiona pasa alimkumbatia na akasugua hivi. Mm-hmm. Hiyo kitu mnafanyanga. Aha. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Kwa hiyo Suleimani anamwambia kijana wake, maana ame notice hizi vitu nilifanya zikaniingiza kwa hii polygamous otas. Mm-hmm. I must warn my sons. Aha. Akamwambia usikumbatie mwanamke mgeni. Mm-hmm. Maana itazaa tatizo ambao inanisumbua saa hii kama mfalme. Aha. Inua mkono sema madhabahu ya immorality. Madhabahu ya immorality. Lazima uniwachilie siku ya leo. Lazima uniwachilie siku. Katika jina la Yesu. Katika jina la Yesu. Utuaseme fire. Fire. Is God helping us today? Yes. Mungu anatusaidia? Yes. Tu hii madhabahu tuvunje ama tuachane nayo? Tuvunje. Hebu tusome ile Leviticus 21 verse 7 ndio nikupatie mambo kadha wa kadha ndio tukapate kuomba. Madhabahu ya immorality very dangerous. Uh-huh. Very dangerous. It has destroyed many destinies. Mm-hmm. Watu ambao wangeenda mbali today they are nothing. Wahubiri wakiwa vijana walikuwa na ubiri wanashikilia kesha walipooa maana hiyo ndoa ilikuwa mtego hawahubiri tena anaweza sifiwe amen hawahubiri tena hata sasa hii wanauliza ningeshikiwa ningetoka kwa hii ndoa aha maana zeta kama ngakwatiwa nikuuma lakini ndio maana walikile is a covenant it has bound them together mm-hmm. amesema yule analala na malaya wanakuwa kitu kimoja uh-huh. sasa kutoka itakuwa ngori uh-huh. amen Amen. Leviticus 21 verse 7. Walawi. Shina moja msari wa saba. Kwa kuwa kuani, aha, ameweka wapo kwa Mungu wake. Kuani. Now you know the Bible says in the book of I think first Peter 1:9, we are a chosen generation, a priesthood. loyal priesthood. Kwa hivyo sisi wote ni makuani mbele za Mungu. Because wakati Yesu alikufa, walipasua ile ilikuwa inatuzuilia. So anybody now can access God. So you are a priest by your own. Amen. Wewe mwenyewe ni kuani. Kwa hivyo anasema makuani wametengwa. Leviticus na kuconnect hiyo na first Peter 1:9 somewhere there. 1:8:9:10 hapo. Anasema sisi ni wateule uzao mteule wa Bwana. Uh-huh. Makuani ambao Mungu ametupatia nafasi tusimame kwa madhabahu yake alafu tufanye transactions. Mm-hmm. Kwa anaongea kuhusu wewe na mimi. Na ambaye ni Walawi ndiye anaongea hiyo maneno. Hizi maneno zinaongelewa na Musa alikuwa anaongelesha Waisraeli. Wa Anawaambia Waisraeli msinyi si watu wa kawaida. Nyinyi watu mmeteuliwa. We ni Muisraeli wakati uliokoka ukapokea Yesu Kristo kama Bwana na Mwokozi ulifanyika Muisraeli. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. Amen. Kwa hivyo tukiingia to this nation of Jesus there are rules and regulations. Uh-huh. Na ndio hizo alikuwa anawasomea wana wa Israeli Leviticus endelea tena. Kwa kuwa kuane um, kwa, 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 kwa Mungu wake. Uh-huh. Kama asiowe kaaba. Uh-huh. Kamwe asiowe nini? Kaaba. Kaaba. Yanda katwae Mungu ukomete nongi. Ndio yes. Amen. Bari yako brada. Inaingia ama inapita pita. Eh. Hey. Unajua hii message itasaidia sana hata sisi inatusaidia lakini unaona hao hao wachanga hao mm. kuna mashida ingine utaavoid tu aha 
kanisa siyo amen kuna mapepo ingine inakula wasichana uta avoid tu kwa sababu umejua ukweli utakuwa unaangalia unasema sitajiingiza kwa hizi vita saa hii wacha ningojie nianzane nazo nikiwa kwa ndoa lakini hizi uh-huh. kwenda pale naingia pale naingia pale hizo zinaitangwa unnecessary battles aha uh-huh. vita ambazo umejiingiza mwenyewe aha uh-huh. bwana yesu apewe sifa amen kwa hivyo kuani ambaye ameteuliwa na Mwenyezi Mungu kamwe asiowe kaapa na pande hiyo ingine asiolewe ama asiolewe na kaapa asiowe kaapa asiolewe na kaapa endelea wala mwanamke asiye bikira mm-hmm. wala aliyepewa talaka bwana asifiwe amen even in divorce woman ndio nimekwambia wengine hapa tulienda tukaoa tukasema mimi ndio nimeoa ya kwanza lakini kuna mwingine tulikuwa tumesha divorce mm-hmm. so This is not my first marriage is my fourth kama fifth. Aha. Uh-huh. Ukiona watu wameanza kuinamia chini ujue hapo ndos. Nimeanza kunguza mahali pabaya lakini Yesu ndiye Bwana siku ya leo. Amen. Na ndiye tumekuja atusaidie. Amen. Haleluya. Amen. Hapo nikamtego shetani ametutega naye lakini naye Mungu wa huruma atatusaidia. Amen. How to identify an altar of immorality in your life? Utajuaje ya kwamba hii madhabahu iko kwangu? Mhm. Utajuaje huwa inanikula? Utajuaje kuna mahali niliingia na ndio hii na manifest leo. Number one, Every time you feel guilty mm-hmm. when God is speaking. Aha. Uh-huh. You feel guilty. Unasikianga hii message. Wanaubiri leo ni, ni, ni kama walisikia story yangu ndio maana wamekuja kuhubiri. Sio kama umeenda kanisani ukasikia watu wakitoka hapo kwa ngii tu anaanza kusema pastor leo alikuwa ananiona. Pastor leo hiyo message ni mimi. Uh-huh. Ni, ni mtu akona hiyo madhabahu. Aha. Uh-huh. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Amen. Wakati utasikia mtu anasema hiyo message vile imehubiriwa leo. Aha. Hiyo ilikuwa kunguzana. Ilikuwa huyu kutkitana kutnanga na mtinanga nosu basa waambie bana yule yule mtinanga nosu. Timu tinanga no ni madhabahu mo tinao. Amen. Si Mungu akusaidie leo tuyanguze kabisa. Amen. Na sio kunguza tuyanguze na tuyapasue. Amen. Sema my father my God. My father my God. Daughters of immorality. Daughters of immorality. In my life. In my life. I denounce you by fire. I denounce you by fire. Break and list my life. Break and list my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Kwa when you feel guilty especially when God is speaking. Aha. Uh-huh. Especially when there is prophetic grace moving. Watu wanaanza kunenoa kiunabii inaona hivi unaanza kushtuka peke yako unasema Jesus nisionekane nilifanya ile nini you feel guilty ni madhabahu ni morality number two, always having self condemnation aha kujihukumu kila wakati unajihukumu tu unajihukumu vitu hata watu waki, kuna watu hii kanisa wanafanyanga hivi unaanza hapo hapo hata hujasemwa unaanza kusema ni mimi ni mimi tu yani unaanza kujihukumu the bible says in romans chapter 8 verse 1 there is therefore no condemnation for those who are in christ jesus amen those who are led by the spirit of god amen there is no condemnation so any time you feel that self condemnation unajihukumu mwenyewe unaona wewe ni kama uwezi tumiwa na mungu unaangalia unaangalia dhambi zako unaona hata uwezi pendwa na mungu ni hiyo madhabahu inakuhukumu mm-hmm. we need to break it today in jesus name amen only nisema amina tuendelee amen number three having divided mind ama double mindedness mm-hmm. those are the people who are not able to make decisions on their own aha uh-huh. they depend on others ukimwambia tufanye hivi ama umwambie enda utafute kitu tu ufanye anataka hivi nitafanya nini yani ako na divided ama ni nianze kitunguu acha nianze tomato akifika kwa tomato anaona ah kitunguu ndio inauzwa vizuri mm-hmm. ako na hiyo double mindedness kwa nasa sio amen ni hiyo madhabahu inagawanya yeye kwa sababu gani ile nafsi aliungana nayo ujuzi na ile ingine ya 2022 2021 na ile ingine ya 2013 hizo nafsi bado zina communicate haleluya amen zina communicate kwa hivyo kuna time inawachilia inaenda pande ile inawachilia inaenda kwa yule kulingana zile madhabahu za immorality huyo mtu amejenga aha atakuwa unstable like water number four, lack of god's blessing hata ile baraka ya mungu tu yani unajua kuna baraka za mungu tu zinaitangwa tu baraka za mungu kama uponyaji huyu mtu saa zote utasikia kizirani ya magonjwa kwake ama familia aziishangi kuna vitu yani za mungu tu za mungu unaweza sema sinusita wasi angai 
When they are moon to spit out a oxygen, I leave and best and being no name at ten bed about with Pusion to Pusio, you know when. Madame Mundo may be it and a miagera to oil it. Lack of God's blessing. They are free blessing from God. We don't pay for them. Well, you know, I got your corona. Me and Nauanas nearly suspect you get related on Nangadapu Yamu. Here, Corona. What what a who fight an oxygen and you in a Tangatanga? Vanessa Spiel. Amen. Nimal to Linguza Mungumbanga as a Motajua Mugu. I got Munga to a nail room. Amen. Number five. Damaged self esteem. Self esteem. You see yourself valueless. You don't value yourself. Unajionango and mutubure. Lack of self esteem. Ata unazakutana mutu kwambia today you are very beautiful. Zeme, beautiful, beautiful. Maui. Then you have given up in life. Niyo malabautu ina sumbua maisha yako. Sileo mungu atosaidi. Amen. Nasema sileo mungu atuone uruma. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Feeling emptiness, both spiritually and physically. Kusikia wea hauna kitu ndani yako. Feeling emptiness. Prayer life, zero. Reading the word of God, zero. Attending church services, zero. Yani you, are, you feel very empty. Hauna kitu unayanza. Atu ukiambu simambe lea watu. Wezi simama ukaongea. Unaonanga mi hata sina kitu ya kusaidia watu. Amen. Amen. Watu wanaweza kuwa mahali 20. Unaambiwa hebu hebu tuambie kitu kulingana hiyo mjadala tumeongea. Unasema ah sina maoni. Na wao tu wamewacho wengi hivi ukaonekana. You feel empty in yourself. Mm-hmm. Ni hiyo mababao. Sema Bwana nisaidie. Bwana nisaidie. Nitakwenda kukombolewa leo. Nitakwenda kukombolewa. Katika leo. jina la Yesu. Katika jina la Yesu. Continuous disappointments. Mambo yote yanatendeka kwako inakujanga tu negative kukufunja moyo kuharibu njina yako ulikuwa umetengeneza disappointments embarrassments everywhere you go madhabahu the immorality mm-hmm. tuvunje tusivunje tuvunje number the next number when you have doubts to everybody you meet it's good to be suspicious to people. But lakini kuna extend inaendanga, unakuwa, unadoubt. Kila mtu, hata mtu wakakuja kuambie vitu nzuri, utamushuku tu. Kuna madaboy inaharibu trust yako na watu, mana inajua. Kuna watu unaweza kutana wa wakuambie ukweli na ukai na wawa kusaidie. Kwa hivyo, inaanza kukueka doubt. Zuika mwemui kutana mtu mkaongea, lakini unaweka ma, question mark. Mm-hmm. Unasikia kabisa huyu hata wengine unawaangalia anga online wanaumbi lakini unaona unafika mahali unaweka question mark mm-hmm. ni hiyo madaba uh-huh. amen amen ikiangalia ijue ukifuata huyu mtu atakufungua inaanza kukuwekea doubts kwa huyo mtu uh-huh. haleluya amen do you know the reason why people hate this church mm-hmm. they hate this church because it is the only church that can liberate them uh-huh. itawaonyesha ukweli Waambiwa hapa hakuna njia. Aha. Kwa sababu shetani anajua akifika hapa wataambiwa hapa ndiyo kuna shida. Anaweka doubts wanauliza hiyo kanisa iko na Mungu. Aha. Je, hiyo kanisa ni ya Mungu? Aha. Na hakuna siku alisikia tukisema shetani asifiwe. Lakini they are just doubting kwa sababu kuna madhabahu ime damage imani yao. Uh-huh. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every evil order of immorality uh-huh. it is breaking my fire in Jesus name. Amen. Hata kama tulifanya tukiwa watoto wadogo, we are going to visit those years. Amen. Destroy it in Jesus mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Number, the next number always meeting people who waste your time. Uh-huh. Meeting time wasters. Watu wanakuaribia time tu. Wanakuaribia masaa. Sometimes it's not you. They are wasting time of your sex partner. Mm-hmm. Yule muliku wako pamonja. But it's just few. Amen. Hii point inazikia, roa na nisikuma sana niseme, ya, ya, na, ni, sasa lazima niseme, kwa sababu it has been too much. Uh-huh. Wale m- tumeo na kuwa, kuolewa. Uh-huh. Ile siku utakaa hivi. Uwanze kuona your partner. Na usikia ukimwambia hata sijui nikikuoa nilikuwa naangalia wapi. Mhm. Ujue sio yeye unaongea na yeye. Uh-huh. Ni yule walikuwa na uhusiano kitabu. Uh-huh. Ndiye ametembea. Aha. Uh-huh. Unaweza sifiwe. Amen. Maana hao watu hawakuachana there is no divorce. Hawako divorce. Aha. Uh-huh. 
Lutonaeri ya umu ndi wimbita ha sweet heart. Na unewe yase wanaheka inesa ni tuawaniwe. Ni kumanisha ula umu ndiweyo na uyu umu ndi na anduwe leto fauti. Aha. Tuko pamoja jamen. Yes. So wakati utahasa kuona unachukia your spouse. Kuna siku aku alikuwa nafanya usilale. Aha. Wanaatuma we try mata kwa muzwani. Aha. Uka. Uka we try mata. Yani ulikuna mpenda such that akikoa unamambia ni kusaidia na maji. Sasa hiyo unaanza kusema ningejua singe kuoa ningejua singe olewa na sasa huyo mtu unasema ange kuoa sio yeye ni yule walikuwa na uhusiano kitambo ndiye amekuja na kwa sababu unachukia kushare unaanza kuandress huyo mtu atoke kwa ndoa yako sasa ukifukuza huu mwili haujashinda maana hiyo roho akienda atarudi tena nayo the best thing ni kufanywa deliverance ya soul type amen haleluya somebody amen i think i'm helping somebody Yes. Ninapojisaidia najua nasaidia mtu. Yes. So wakati utaona umeanza kuchukia. Aha. Uh-huh. Mke wako ama bwana yako. Please don't take it lightly. Na ni kitu imekuwa ikiokaa, inakaa inajirudia, inakaa inajirudia, inakaa. Ina... Sasa ujue ya kwamba behind huyu mtu ninachukia kuna watu wengine. Aha. Uh-huh. For example kama ni mtuwa ameoa madam anaitwa anaitwa Mary. Mtu atakaa hivi aanze kuona Mary nyuma ya Mary kuna Joshua. Aha. Amen. Amen. Akiangalia huyu Mary kuna roho ya kiume yako naye. Sasa kingine anaongeanga hapa kama yeye ndiye mwanaume. Sasa ujue si Mary anaongea ni yule Joshua walikuwa na uhusiano na hawakutenganishwa. Aha. Amen. Amen. Di unaonanga hapo ndio roho ya Jezebel inaingiliana. Aha. Inatoka wapi? Ni mwanaume mwanaume ameingia ndani ya mwanamke, a mwanamke anataka kutawala mwanaume kwa sababu ni wanaume wawili kwa nyumba Aha. na kila mwana, kazi ya mwanaume ni kutawala kwa hivyo kutakuwa na matatizo sasa sikini unaona mwimbaji na aita wanaume matelemi si kupenda kwao ni wanawake wanawatembelea wale walikuwa na uhusiano kwa hivyo anaanza kukaa ategemee mwanamke maana yeye ni mwanamke mwenzake are you catching the flow yes na ni madhabao ya morality ikikosa kushughulikiwa itavunja ndoa zetu Aha tushungulikie 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 ani anasema tuendelee amen haleluya amen the next number when you have damaged relationship with the god mhm uhusiano wako na mungu unakuwa umeharibika na unajua hii inakujanga aje inakujanga kama mnaenda kanisa moja yule mtu mlikuwa mmekaa pamoja anakukosea Uh-huh. Kitu ambacho maandiko inasema musamee mara saba mara sabini kwa mm-hmm. siku. Mm-hmm. Unasema kanisa wasu na ukala nondo waangania. Eh tinganya ni morality madhabao mambo ya kunyia kanisa. Naenda kwa na angauziano wako na angai. Aha. Na kwa sababu nimekuambia shetani ni roho ataingia mtu. Aha. Naye Mungu ni roho ataingia mtu ndio ya communicate na wewe. Kwa hivyo atakuja hapo a make sure umekosewa tu na mtu hapo ndio haribu uhusiano wako na Mungu. Wewe utaenda ukisema mama Soenso akona mdomo nyingi. Brother Soenso akona msemano nyingi. Na si kusemano ni madhabao iko ndani yako huku vunja. Mm-hmm. Sema bwana nionee huruma. Bwana nionee. Na unisaidie siku ya leo. Na unisaidie siku ya leo. Haleluya. Amen. Damage the future. When you, you, you unaanza kuwa na na doubt ya kwamba you will make it in life. Mm-hmm. Mtu anasimama hapa na kuambia mahali Mungu amemtoa. Mimi nilikuwa mlevi Mungu akanisaidia kama anisaidia atakusaidia. Kuna sema haleluya. Ukitoka ibada wanakuambia uende wapi. Wewe na yeye ni watu wawili tofauti. Anaanza kukiri. Aha. Um, doubt. Mhm. Unakuwa hauna future. Unafanyanga ma- mambo ya leo tu peke yake uone pale mbele. Ni madhabao ya immorality inafanya kazi. Some uh-huh. say altar versus altars. Altar versus altars. Every altar of immorality. Every altar of immorality. Destabilizing my spiritual life. Destabilizing my spiritual life. Destabilizing my physical life. Destabilizing my spiritual life. I must break you by fire. I must break you by fire. Kila madhabao ya immorality. Kila madhabao ya immorality. Inaosumbua hatima yangu. Inaosumbua hatima yangu. Inaosumbua maisha yangu. Inaosumbua ya kiroho na ya kimwili. Ya kiroho na ya kimwili. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. Another thing, wakati unasikia is like umetolewa kwa 
kwa shetani na ukarushwa tena kwa matatizo uh-huh. feeling like you have been de- de- delivered from satan and then you have been delivered to destruction aha uh-huh. ni wale wakamba wanasemanga aumie kimbusia akalika kimbo aha uh-huh. amen Amen. Una unatoka tatizo hii unaingia tatizo ile. Kwa sababu gani? You have jumped from an evil altar, you have landed to another evil altar. So you are experiencing things that you don't like. Kwa sababu mm-hmm. unafuatilia madhabahu inafanana na ile uh-huh. yako. Maana haukuvunja. Sema madhabahu ya destruction. Madhabahu ya destruction. Utaniwaachilia siku ya leo. Utaniwaachilia siku ya leo. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Namba The next number continuously experiencing spiritual wives and husbands. Mm-hmm. Mara kwa mara unalala unaota na mwanamke, mnafanya mapenzi. Unaamka unapata ni kweli nilikuwa na yeye. Mara kwa mara unaota unafanya mapenzi na mwanaume, unaamka unasema kabisa leo hii nilikuwa na mtu na huna mtu uko peke yako. Mm-hmm. Ni hiyo madhabahu. Ni wale mlikuwa na wao they are still following maana madhabahu haikuvunjwa inaendelea kutuma hiyo roho Amen. Amen. Waje niwaambie hata tukajifanya aje. kama pastors wanapitia hizo vitu kila mtu anapitia. Uh-huh. Amen. Amen. Mimi wakati nilifundishwa haya mafundisho na baba yetu akiro hapa. Nilijua kabisa hiyo ndio maana mimi nilikuwa pastor bado lakini sometimes imagine you have your wife na unaona mnalala na your wife in the dream uh-huh. na hapo hapa physically but you are not doing anything. Aha. Uh-huh. Wanajua watakuja kwa sura ya huyo mtu ambaye huwezi ukashuku. Uh-huh. Watakufanyisha hivyo, watachafua anga yako. Mm-hmm. Wanaitangwa dream defilers. Uh-huh. Wanachafua spiritual realm yako. Hallelujah. Mm-hmm. So ukiendelea kuota hizo ndoto, unalala na watu kwa ndoto, mnafanya mapenzi, ni kuambiwa kuna madhabahu huo inatuma hiyo roho na haijawahi vunjwa. Kama unataka hao watu waache kutembelea vunja hiyo madhabahu ya immorality. Amen. Ndio ina license hizo roho. Aha. Kumbuka nilikwambia madhabahu is a licensing platform. Aha. Ndio huwa roho zinapewa ruhusa ya kufanya kazi. That means kuna hiyo madhabahu inatuma hizo vitu. Sema my father my god. My father. Hotas of immorality. Hotas of Where are you in my life? Where are you in my life? I set you on fire. I set you on fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. When you have damaged prayer life Unaombanga tu wakati uko church, uwezi ukaombea nyumbani? Aha. Ni madhabahu ya morality. Haipendi maombi. Maana maombi itaididimiza. So when you have damaged prayer life, there is an altar of immorality that is manifesting in your life. Mm-hmm. Inakuua tu pole pole, ndio ukose kuomba, it take over. Sema baba yangu na Mungu wangu. Baba yangu na Mungu. Inaomba huruma na rehema zako. Inaomba huruma na rehema. Nikombolewe na haya madhabahu. Nikombolewe na haya madhabahu. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo. When you have when you see troubled marriages, ndoa ziko na matatizo. Ni madhabahu ya immorality. Uh-huh. Hiyo nimekuelezea vizuri sana. Nikakwambia wakati utaanza kuona unachokia your spouse. Sio yeye yule walikuwa na uhusiano pamoja uh-huh. ametutembelea so you are seeing a person who looks like you uh-huh. na iruhusiwa wanaume wawili wakae nyumba moja uh-huh. ama wanawake wawili wakae nyumba moja kwa hivyo kutakuwa na automatic enmity uh-huh. namba ya mwisho failure of being proposed for marriage umefika umri wa kuoa ama kuolewa na hakuna mtu anauliza wewe ni wale watu nilikuwa nasema ako na figa juu ya figa ameongezea makeup lakini hakuna mtu anataka yeye mm-hmm. amen amen na wale yule anatokea anampatia mtoto na anamwacha tu hataki kumuoa mhm wanaweza sio amen kama ni mwanaume atapata mwanamke amwambie mimi kulala tutalala lakini kuolewa uwezi nioa uko na madhabahu inakataza mtu mwingine kuingia maana anataka kuingia lakini anaona makatazo kuna makatazo kwa anga inasema huyu ako na mwenyewe mm-hmm. spiritually huyu mtu ako na mwenyewe kwa uh-huh. hivyo labda mulale na umwache aende uh-huh. have you never seen girls wanawake ako na watoto saba na hajaolewa amen amen hizo madhabahu uh-huh. 
Manaume ame akona watoto na wake waki waza na yewa naendaka wana mwajia watoto. Have you never seen them? Yes. Ni otas of immorality. Uh-huh. Should we break them or we leave them? We break them. Nasema tutazifunja siku ya leo. Amen. Atuta ngojea shetani ya endaye kwa embaras kanisa tokiwa hapa. Uh-huh. Iyo madabao tutaifunja ukisema fire vizuri hapa. Fire. Ongeza sauti kuliko jirani yako. Fire. Ikiweze kana mkono ikiwe juu. Fire. In the name of Jesus. Namba ya mwisho. Oh my God. Niko na mingi. Hearing the voices of those who you committed sex with. Speaking to you or calling you. Unasikia sauti za hawa watu. Ana sometimes unaweza chukua simu upigiwe na niyo namba mtu abujui. Amen. Amen. Ulikuwa na uhusiano kitambo sana. Sasa umeoa ama umeolewa. Alafu akipiga unasema, "Hello?" Ni, ni James. Lakini si James. Ni yule James mlikuwa na uhusiano lakini huyu an, anaongea kama huyo James. Aha. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Haki Mungu atusaidia sana leo. Amen. Amen. Hata kuota na ye, every time you dream with that person. Na wengine wanaendanga to extend anaota wakiwa kwa hicho hicho kitendo hiyo miaka. Unaambiwa vizuri hiyo madhabao hapo iliinukia vizuri sana. Uh-huh. Mungu atatusaidia. Amen. Katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Hata kanisa ya online inasema hii mambo tushungulikie kabisa. Amen. The other thing demonic nightmares and thoughts causing you to commit sexual immorality demonic nightmares and thoughts ni wale watu unaona sasa shetani ame advance akajua umejua hiyo ulienda kanzani ukiambiwa usifanye immorality tena anapindua sasa anakuletea pornography mm-hmm. wanafanya masturbation na ile ingine so anaweka picha anaangalia na anafanya hiyo maneno Aha. Hiyo ni madhaba wengine. Huyo mtu unaangalia ako na hiyo spirit. Aha. Ukifanya hivyo unajenga madhaba wengine. Aha. Amen. Amen. Someone say every evil order. Every evil order. Of immorality. Of immorality. You are breaking today. You are breaking today. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I say in the name of Jesus. In ability to maintain Christian life. In ability to maintain Christian life kutokalisha wokofu unaokoka leo unasikianga mtu anakuja hapa anasema niko na miaka 2 sitaenda kanisani lakini mimi nimeokoka kile kilimtoa ni hii madhabao nimekuambia uwe inatenganisha mtu ushirika wake na Mungu inamtoa na kunyakunywa pombe anasema ah hii pombe nisaidie anarudi tena kanisani anaokoka miaka 2 3 anasema ah acha nirudi kwa mkoka anaendanga hivi ina ability to maintain salvation ni madhabao ya immorality uh-huh. ina ability to sustain marriages hiyo nimesema and then feeling hatred to your spouse. Uh-huh. Continuously dreaming with previous partners having sex with them. Divorce inaweza kuweko maana naye mtu hata kaa na mtu ambaye anataka kumuua utatoka. Lakini ukitoka kama utawalewa wengine vunja hiyo madhabao ya huyo mwingine kwanza. Uh-huh. Vanessa Spiro. Amen. Vunja ya huyo mwingine kwanza. Enda mfanywe ibada useme hii ni dhabihu ninainua. Madhabao inavunjangwa na dhabihu. Amen. Inapeleka mbuzi kanisani. Yule mtu alikuwa amenioa. Sasa sasa tuliwachana alikuwa na threaten kuniua na tukaenda kwa serikali tukawachana. Sasa nikarudisha makaratasi I'm free to be married ama I'm free to marry. Lazima niende nivunje hiyo. Kama sitafanya hivyo nimempatia nafasi kiroho atakuwa ananitembelea. Mm-hmm. Amen. Amen. Na akinitembelea ataharibu yule nimeoa saa hii. Uh-huh. May God help us in Jesus name. Amen. How to come out of these altars? Hapo ndio tutakuwa namalizia. Ndio tuombe maombi ya fujo sana hapa katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Number one, admit that you sinned against God and against your body. Kubali ya kwamba ulikosea Mungu na pia ukajikosea wewe. Mhm. Haleluya. Amen. Hiyo ukikosa kukubali, basi hautaomba msamaha. Lakini ukikubali useme for sure I did it. Na si kuwa najua kama hii kitu ni madhabao. Mungu nilifanya nikakukosea. Hata nikajikosea kama kuani. Maana umesema kuani asiwe mtu ambaye amepeana talaka. Uh-huh. Mungu nionee huruma na unisamee. Aha. Uh-huh. Hiyo ndio number one. Number two. Give a separation sacrifice. Katika madhabao. Enda kwa madhabao iko na revelation na mtu ambaye maneno yake imeheshimika kwa anga umpatie dhabihu muambie mimi nimeona 
I have your track record in ministry. Nimeona vile Mungu anakutumia. Na hii mara ambayo mimi inanisumbua. Ndio maana nimekuja na dhabihu leo. Nimekuambia enda usome. Hebu nisome verse 14 Leviticus 21 verse 14. Anasema mtu akipatikana tatizo kama hiyo aende na mwana kondoo mbele ya kuani. Kama kondoo ya kuteketezwa ndio iteketeze hiyo madhabahu. Ndio akubalike sasa kuwa free kwa pamoja kanisa. Yes. Kama tuko pamoja hebu nione hii. Mungu atusaidie ama tu muonaona aje. Mungu atusaidie. Atatusaidia kabisa. Kwa hivyo, give a separation sacrifice. Hebu nisome Leviticus 21 verse 14. Amen pastor. Verse 14 of Leviticus. Let me read. Arusi kwa mwanamke mchana. Endelea. Mwanamke asiyebikira uh-huh. wala kaaba. Uh-huh. Lazima hawe bikira kutoka kwa watu wake mwenyewe. Endelea. Asije akawatia najisi watoto wake mwenyewe. Tukiendelea nitafuti hiyo scripture inasema aende I think ni hapo verse 9 10 hapo. Inaongea kuhusu kama atapatikana jambo kama hiyo ya hiyo madhabahu aende kwa kuani na kondoo ya kus ya kuteketezwa. Utanitafutia alafu tutaendelea. Number 3 you must engage in spiritual warfare and deep fasting. Tunaona tulipoanza hii msururu ya breaking waters. Hii wiki tumekuwa na maombi siku tatu. Sasa the more tunaendelea, the more we must go deeper. Amen. Tuingie mahali maana sasa tumeanza kuingia personal altar deliverance. Uh-huh. Mtu ajikomboe sasa maana zingine hata tukidini na zile za kule territory, vijijini, family, lakini ndani yetu kuna madhabahu Bado hii iko ndani yetu itafungua mlango hizo zingine zianze kutena ku reinforce. Uh-huh. Aleluya. Amen. Yesu alisema hivi. Mtu afanywe najisi na kile kinachoingia kwa mdomo wake. Mm-hmm. Lakini anafanywa najisi na kile kinatoka ndani yake. Uh-huh. Kwa hivyo akiwa na madhabahu mabaya atakipo ni kutoa vitu mbaya. Aleluya. Amen. Kwa hivyo you must against this is not a, 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 a choice. It's not an option. You must engage in deep spiritual warfare and deep fasting. Uh-huh. Unazama nitafunga niombe. Hii roo lazima itoke. Uh-huh. Hii madamo lazima ivunjike. Mi mwenyewe ndiyo niliingiza, mi mwenyewe ndiyo naishugulikia. Aha. Uh-huh. Kwa maipata? Sawa, tutasoma siku ingina. Number four, confess to those who you committed it with. Ikiwezekana, kama inawezekana. Mungina wezekua walikufa. Mhm. Mimi after kuhubiriwa hii message na baba yetu wa kiro. I called Sam. Hello. Eh, Wanaezo wa sifiwe. Amen. Mana watu wa meogoka. Hato wengine ni washirika. Wana bijangu kwa party time. Nika wambia unakumbuka hile kambanga. Eh, is a man. Si ngumu. Ukiwa umefunguliwa si ngumu. Uh-huh. Utampigio muambia hiyo kitu lifanya. Numefundiswa levalashi ningine hapa. Na nimeona hiyo kitu si mzuri. Uh-huh. Kwa hivyo tafadhali. Mimi ni same. Na hiyo tuwachia hapa. Na uzuwe ni tumia SMS inaelegea pande hiyo. Mhm. Ni wezi mundu mwa komie imwe. Tuna inaitu yanu. Mundu mwa komie imwe onoke efa nyata. Mwa komana no wewe hake. Si ukweli. Yeah. So ane sasa mkubaliane. Vile muli kubaliana physically. Muonge teno muambie. Sasa mimi yo maneno. Hata nikijaribu kukuja. Nikataze kabisa. Aha. Uh-huh. Amen. Amen. Ona wewe ndi ukapu lutisu mwa lea piyo. Lea na edha pato neka wish out. Aha. Uh-huh. Ni wete via. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Sasa tutafanya aje. Si lazima tujisaidie. Yes. Na kama kwa hapa leo usikubali mutoke kwa hile gate kabla mjafanya nyo nini. Uh-huh. Mwite pale kama muna exchange number tu muambia. Unajua kale kambani. Nini kitikisha hapa. Na ayo kwa sabu itakuwa shita ingine umesikia na ufanya. Uh-huh. My friend you can die even physically. Uh-huh. Unaesa kufa. Unaesa kufa. Mana mungu ataona joker. Uh-huh. Na atapiga wewe mapigo mabaya Sema siyo mimi Siyo mimi Namba ya tano Break the altar Anabawi nafunjwa aje Unaenda kwa mungu Unatafuta kazi ufanyia mungu uh-huh. Umuambia sini nifanya kitendo eh, Nilitumia nguvu zangu Nikafanya hicho kitendo Na mini nitafanya kitu kwako Kama ni kujenga, saa hii mtumishu wa mungu anandalea kujenga. Uzeme, ikijengwa, nilazima na mimi jenga. Ditakuwa naambia mungu, unaona hii mabati hii. Hii ni hile ya kufunja hile ya morality. Aha. Fanya kitu kwa mungu ambayo inayazaonekana. 
Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Kwanza iende tu extend kama ulizaa na yeye. Umwambie Mungu nilizaa na yeye na siwezi sasa fanya hivyo tena siwezi rudi huko. Nitaleta kambuzi ka, ka, kaliali yangu hapo kanisani ama kuku. Kitu tu hapo ki represent huyu mtoto ndio oh. tukanzo hiyo mababa. Amen. Tuko pamoja. Yes. Nashukuru Mungu hakuna moja nilizaa na yeye acha mke wangu. Ha wengine ilikuwa mchezo tu. Mm-hmm. Itapita za mtaani. Mm-hmm. Hata mimi mwenyewe nilifanya. Mhm. Mimi si malaika nilifanya. Kuna wakati siku alimeokoka, alikuwa na sadaka nyingi sana. Mhm. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Tusijifanye wapendo. Hii kitu inashika kila mtu. Aha. Uh-huh. Kuanzia Archbishop Ark of the Arts Pop. Unaona? Tunateremka mpaka present worship na Sunday school teacher. Kila mtu hii kitu inamtafuta. Mm-hmm. Na ulifanya. Haleluya. Amen. Na hakuna njia nyingine, njia ndio hiyo. Na namba ya mwisho begin to live a righteous life. Amen. Anza kukaa maisha mazuri sasa. Na ikiwezekana God to an extent, saidia wengine wasipitie hiyo njia ulipitia. Aha. Uh-huh. Ndio wasijiingize kwa madhabahu hizo. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Amen. Kwa hivyo siku ya leo dhabiu ambazo tunatolea Mungu hapa sadaka. Number one ni za separation. Ah watu tutenganishe na wao kabisa. Wawe au watutembelei kwa ndoto hata maono. Hata mawazo hivi ukifunga macho uone picha yake tufanye separation. Tuatoe kabisa kabisa. Amen. 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 Alafu tukimaliza hapa because hii kitu inaendelea mpaka next week. We must thank God because of this revelation because it is going to help us and generations to come. Amen. And let me tell you for free. If you are not going to handle this thing, there is a generation that will blame you. Uh-huh. Kuna kizazi kitakuja kukulaumu. Maana ulijua njia ya kuwatengenezea eh, barabara na huku watengenezea. Uh-huh. So please be a good person. Live a, a, a special legacy. Tengenezea watu njia wale watakuja wasipigane hizi vita wakuje ku build on kile tumetengeneza. Amen. Nani anakubaliana mimi hapa? Amen. Haleluya. Amen. Hakuna haja kama tumejua ukweli tufanye ukweli. Wale watakuja nyuma yetu wafanye kutembea kwa baraka. Wazikuwa wanavunja madhabahu, waanze kujenga madhabahu ya Mungu. Haleluya. Amen. So Mungu awabariki sana wale wamekuwa mnafuatilia online na wale tuko hapa kanisani. Na nafasi hii sasa ni ya kutoa sadaka. Na sadaka ya leo inaitwa ya separation. Mtu yote unanitazama na kunisikiza. Madhabao ya immorality. Uwe unajua ama unjui. Okay, umeoa na huku umefanya. Unajuaje huyo partner wako akufanya? Kwa hivyo unahusia, unahusishwa kwa hiyo. Sasa mlipoungana umehusishwa kile ako nacho. Unaona? Hata kama hujaoa na hujaolewa na hujawahi fanya hivyo, do it for the sake of the future husband, future wife. Itakusaidia wewe na wale watakuja nyuma yako. Kwa hivyo ni masaa ya kutoa sadaka inaitwa ya separation. Ingia kwa simu yako, Mpesa, wale mnatumia equity, wale wanatumia any kind of giving you want to give. Usipitwe na ile revelation maana haujui Mungu ataongea tena lini kupitia njia hiyo. Tafuta dhambiu nzuri. Useme ninapoitoa kwa haya madhambao. Mimi nafanya separation. Na any party na tulifanya mapenzi na yeye. Niwe nilikuwa ninajua ama sikuwa najua Mungu wangu mimi ninaomba onisame kwa kukosea na kujikosea. Ninatoa sadaka hii ya separation. Makosa hiyo isihesabiwe kwangu tena. Mungu nitakase nifungue kabisa na wanibariki ni kutumikie. Kwa hivyo sasa ni masaa ya kufanya ibada ya separation. Ibada ya separation. Ibada ya separation. Tutamlilia Mungu tu, tutamuita Mungu tu, lakini lazima tuwe na kitu kinatuwakilisha kwa madhabahu ambacho kitaruhusu hiyo roho tunaita itembee kwetu. Uh-huh. Kwa hivyo wale tuko online, tuko hapa kanisani ni masaa ya kufanya hiyo kazi. Maana saa hii tunaingia kwa anga, tunaleta fujo hapo, wengine wanakufuata fuata tutawashika tutawangoa na mizizi na hata wai kukuona tena katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Amen. Kwa hivyo wale tuko hapa kanisani, hebu andaa sadaka yako. Inaitwa ya separation offering. Kutenganishwa, tufanye talaka leo. Tuandike document inasema ya kwamba you are owned by one man, you are owned by one wife. We si mtu wa kushare. Hata kama hujaoa na kuolewa, fanya ibada kwa sababu ya ndoa yako ya kesho. Maandiko inasema hakuna mnyama atakosa mwenzake. Unatumainia siku moja uwe na ndoa. Kama utaifanyia ibada kama hii, italeta matatizo. Kwa hivyo this a privilege is a no, golden opportunity Mungu ametupatia sababu ya mambo kama hayo. Mungu ataweza kutubariki sana.
Kwa hivyo ni masaa ya sadaka. Simama tu mahali ulipo, shika sadaka yako. Ibada za madhabahu sikuange na maombi nyingi inategemea madhabahu ya mtu. Kwa hivyo hata tukaomba sana, maombi ni mazuri, lakini we need to do something on the altar. We need to sacrifice. Tunahitaji tuchinje. Tunahitaji tuchinje. Hallelujah. Hakuna wakufanana na Yesu. Hakuna wakufanana na Yesu. Eh hakuna wakufanana na baba. Hakuna wakufanana na Yesu. Eh akisema ndio hakuna wakupiga. Hakuna wakufanana na Nimemuona baba ni mwaminifu Hakuna wakufanana na ye Nimemuona baba kusaidia Hakuna wakufanana na ye 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 ni baba hawezi bandilika Hakuna wakufanana na ye Na kifungua hafungua kabisa Hakuna wakufanana na ye Ye Anaweza baba Anaweza baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye Na ye ye ni mwema Ye ni mwema baba Ye ni mwema baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye 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 anatosha Ye ye Anatosha baba Anatosha baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye Ye wauruma Ye wauruma baba Ye wauruma baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye Ye asame Asame baba Ye asame baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye Na ye asame Ye asame baba Ye asame baba Hakuna wakufana na na ye Na ye atakasa Ye Hebu yo sadaka tuna mtolea mungu kamuambie bwana Hii ndiyo nabiu tuna songesa kwenye manabaha Wenda ikawa siku wa tayari Baba wangu na mungu wangu nimesikia sauti yako Nimejua hii nambi nimefanya kinyume na wewe Nimefanya hata kinyume na maisha yako mime mwenyewe My father my God I pray Have mercy on me Unione uruma siku ya leo Hapo nyumbani tumuombe bwana tu Hata unapo tuma sadaka yako Ambatanisha na maombi ya kumuambia bwana Ni urumie Hii dhambi nilifanya Kinyume na mapensi yako Kinyume na maisha yangu mwenyewe Kinyume na destiny yangu Na we mungu di unawezo kanionea uruma Umejawa na uruma Umejawa na reema My father my God Here my prayer today Forgive me Forgive me oh God Let your mercies be upon my life Omba omba kabisa Ongea na mungu Nila mashande lelele bo salama dadia Umeja wana rema na nema Mewe ni jehova Umeja wana rema Na nema tenu Kama siyo wewe Kama siyo wewe Ijekuwa wapi ni Kama siyo wewe baba let your spirit move Let your spirit move and deliver us Era bahanda ya bagadish Sekola hani ya basoko pia kataya Ne kama siyo wewe Kama siyo wewe Baba baba Kige tuwa wapi Kama siyo wewe ya we Hallelujah, Baba. 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 Hallelujah, Baba.
God bless you, Timothy Wambua, kusabu ya sadaka yako katika ima thabao. Mungu wa kubariki faith, mwikali kusabu ya sadaka yako katika ima thabao. Inawambea njini nyote ambao menguza ima thabao. Let there be spiritual separation in the mighty name of Jesus. And may the mercies of the Lord incubate your lives, envelop the, your destinies in the mighty name of Jesus. Let it be well with you in Jesus' mighty name. Any demon that was claiming that you are connected to it, let it be separated completely out of your life in Jesus' mighty name, the Son of the Living God. Baba katika jina la Yesu na ni kwa sababu ya sadaka hii kupitia impesa. Ah, kwa sababu ya kujunganisha na neema ilio juu ya mtumishi wa Mungu na tangaza ya kwamba hiyo connection inaleta deliverance katika maisha yako. And every order that has been standing against you, against your ministry, against your calling, you evil order, your time is up. You must lose and go. 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 Lose now. I break you by the power of the Holy Spirit of God. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Mimi nataka tuombe, lakini sijaona tumefanya ibada ya kupendeza mungu. Amen. Kuna ibada uwa zinapendeza mungu. Kuna ibada uwa zinafanya nini? Zinapendeza mungu. Na inawezekana ya kwamba hauku unajua kama mungu ataongea hivi ya meongea leo. Kanyesu wa sifio? Amen. Just for the sake of your life, your destiny, your future, ministry, chochote mungu wa meweka ndani yako. Ningependa tu, unajua ni yako, unajisaidia. Ni kupatie baasha, mtu weke elfu moja na miambiki, useme ni naanza, kufunji ya mwalaba, wendi unajua wale watu mulifanya hivyo. My friend, haiwezi toka na maombi peke yake, lazima ifanyue ibada, na ibada haiwezi ifanyua pasipo na babiu katika mwalaba. Wanaesu wa sifiwa? Amen. Uchukue hii baasha, wende ukai hivi, wende mtu ukona akili nzuri tu, we reflect back. Uwone wa kwanza alikuwa naitwa hivi. Umutole the view a separation. Uwone wa pili umfanyie the same. Wa tatu hivyo. Kama ukona ishirini wafanyie wote. Kama utafanyia hivyo. Kuna vitu sitabaki na question mark katika anga yako. Kana isu asifiwa? Kivyo. Na kupatia baasha hii ya nini? Enda uweke sadaka hapo. Useme mimi ni napotua hii elfu moja na miambili. Napotua hii miatisa. Inapotua hii miya saba, hii miya tano, ile kiwango utatoa tu. Lakini anzia maali. Usiwachi hiyo kazi ikiwa hapo. Mana, hakuna mtu mingini atafanya. Ukiwacha, unawachia wale watakuja nyuma yako. Na watakuja kurudia kazi ambao, ungaifanya saa hii. Aleluya. Hata uko online, unasema ya kwamba, mimi nataka hiyo. Nafasi hiko. Useme nafanya ibada ya kwanza. Ni separate huyo. Nifanya ya pili, ni separate. Kama ni wawili, wafanya ibada mpaka usikie kabisa. Awa kutembelei kwa ndoto, awako kwa mawanzo yako, hakuna kitu yao muko connected na wao, hakuna kitu wanaeza tumia kama legal ground wa kuaccess katika anga yako. Useme ya kwamba nafanya ibada na separation. Uko hapo ama uko hapa kanzani na sema, mimi nipewe baasha, nikafanya ibada ya ina hiyo. Si ukujia hii baasha, napo enda kutuwa hiyo sadaka. Wende ukaye tupeke yako, ujifikirie. Useme, mimi nitaanzia maali. Nani ya nakujia? Eee. Anzia maali. Kama wa mama kama wa wanafanya. Na vijana wale chibukizi kama mimi. Kanaesu wa sifeo? Amen. Kuseme ya kwamba, mimi nafanya ibada. Haa watu nitamatua kwa anga yangu. La sijo, tutaenelea tuyo deliverance azote. Hatu mwachili. Na mengine inajifanyanga ni shoshu na si shoshu. Ni mutu tumu lifanya hizo vitu pamoja. Kama unakuja kuja. Ya. Nifu wakama mkama. 
kila revelation inakujanga na neema yake na kuna wale watu inakuanga inatafuta wewe endelea kusema tu huko fanya endelea tu kusema huko fanya Mungu awabariki sana nataka tuingie kwa maombi tutafanya ibada ya kuomba msamaha kushuka mbele za Mungu tumwambie Bwana tulifanya tulikukosea na hata sisi wenyewe tulijikosea Mungu nisamehe wale tumechukua baasha uombe ukisema Mungu ninapoirudisha hiyo madhabahu ivunjike nisihesabiwe tena kama mwanajisi nisihesabiwe tena kama mtu ambaye anafanya uzinzi sasa Mungu tuanze upya mimi ni kuani anza na utaona vile watu wengine Mungu ataanza kuwatumia wewe fanye hiyo ibada tu hata kama hukuna kitu kingine una test kwa hii madhabahu test hiyo ya leo utaona vile Mungu atakutumia nataka tukaribia hapa mbele tuabudu Mungu dakika mbili tatu alafu nitakuingiza kwa maombi ya spiritual warfare remember nimesema procedure number one ask admit ya kwamba ulifanya number two ask for forgiveness to god and to yourself on behalf of you yourself kuwa na separation uh, sacrifice ingia kwa deep spiritual warfare Amen. then after hiyo maombi spiritual warfare tutaingia hapo kwa anga yako tutatorosha wale wa kutoroshwa wale wa kujileta hiyo maroya ya ndoto mbaya tutaitorosha itakimbia iende Eh, ma shetani imetumwa na wachawi madhabahu zao hiyo tutatorosha lakini hii ya kufanyia ibada ni kuwa, na kuhakikishia kwamba singuzi hiyo kwa sababu hiyo ni yako ulifanya peke yako mimi siku wako oho haleluya amen ninua mikono yako songea songea hapa tumwabudu bwana hakuna mungu kama wewe hakuna haleluya kama wewe eh hakuna eh Mbozi kama wewe Unaweza Kama wewe Kama wewe Kama wewe Kama wewe Sijaona nema Kama yako Kama wewe Kama wewe Kama wewe Kama wewe Wow. 
Una manga pao, si la ni sombo wana ni wewe Baba ni saidi Baba, aleluya Baba, ni wewe Si na mwigi na ni wewe Baba ya ni wewe Aleluya Ukini yato, ni taenda wapi ni wewe Wana yesu ni wewe Hallelujah. Oh, 
sana angalia baba Egemeo angalia baba Hatuna mwingine angalia baba Angalia 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 Unaweza ukaenda mbele za Bwana sasa ukamwambie Bwana Uniangalie mimi ni mtu ambaye nimejaa taabu makosa yale ambao nimeyafanya ni wewe tu naweza ukanipokelea dhambi zile nimezifanya Jehova na hasa hasa dhambi za uzinzi my father my god i come before thy presence now and i surrender ninaomba utakaso siku ya leo kuna uzinzi nilifanya Bwana nilitoka kwa nyumba nikaenda kufanya nilitoa pesa nikaenda kufanya mambo haya yote Bwana niliyafanya na ni wewe tu mwenye huruma unaweza ukanisamee nilikosa mbele zako nikakosa mbele ya mwili wangu baba yangu na Mungu wangu inakuomba siku ya leo na nyenyekea mbele zako wewe ni mwenye huruma Jehova oh Nipe nafasi jipya leo. Nipe nafasi upya siku ya leo. Ukanibadilishie historia ambao niliandikisha kwa matendo yangu mabaya. Baba ukaniondolea kila hatia niliyofanya ya kitendo cha uzinzi. Oh you are the God of mercy. Have mercy on me now. Let your grace come upon me. My father, my father. Nilifanya na mtu A. Eh. Nikafanya na mtu B, nikafanya na mtu C. My father, my father, as I mentioned them before you, Father, I pray now, have mercy on me, have mercy on me, Jehovah God. Nione huruma, ongea na Bwana usinyamase. Mwambie Bwana nilifanya na huyu, hata nikafanya na huyu. My father, my father, wewe Mungu umejaa huruma. Unisamee. Unisamee Bwana. Kitendo hiki najua hakikupendezi. Ni kitendo cha kiuchawi. Ni kitendo cha kiuchawi. Oh my father my God. Nisamee Bwana. Oh nisamee Yesu wangu. Oh hivi dabao niliinua. Pasipo na kujua. Singine nikainua nikijua. Oh God have mercy on me. Hii madhabahu inasumbua maisha yangu. Inasumbua huduma yangu. Inasumbua ndoa yangu, inasumbua kipawa papa yangu na Mungu wangu. Nipe nafasi tena kama Samson naomba. One more time Jehovah God, fill me with your power. My father my God, nafunulia sauti mtana wa leo. Nipatie nafasi ingine Jehovah. Nimetubu dhambi zangu. Nimetubu makosa yangu. Nimegeuka nimekuja kwako Bwana. Omba mbele za Bwana tu. Tumwambie Bwana tusamee. Wapendwa dhambi imetawala. Imeingia mpaka kwa madhabahu. Ni Mungu tu atuonee huruma. Tumwambie Bwana kanisa imechafuka. Wale ulituma wametafuka. Na ni wewe tu Bwana utaturumia. Ni wewe tu Bwana utatuponya. Ni wewe tu Bwana unaweza ukatusamee. Oh Lord we have turned again. We have gone against you and we have turned to you again. Tulikuwa tumeenda kinyume na wewe. Tumekurudia Bwana. Naomba ukaturudie. Ninakurudia Bwana. Nirudie na mimi Bwana. Nirudie Jehova. Oh umesema ya kwamba hata kama dhambi zetu ni nyekundu kama damu Bwana utazifanya nyeupe kama deluji. Lord I, com- I confess. I confess. Oh Lord we confess. We confess oh God. Japo kuwa zimekuwa nyekundu. Bwana tusamee. Tumekulilia mbele ya madhabahu. Tumekulilia mbele ya madhabahu. Tumekulilia mbele ya madhabahu. Tunashuka chini Bwana. Tunasongelea kwako ndio kuna msaada. Mungu wa huruma. Oh tusamee Bwana. 
makosa ya tumeyafanya wewe tu unaweza ukatusamea naomba sasa ile damu ya Yesu Kristo ambayo inatakasa ile damu inaosha ile damu inaondoa hatia ile damu ambayo oh Yesu Kristo inaondoa hatia ikaondoa hatia katika maisha yetu kwa wanaume na wanawake hatia ikaondolewe kwa ajili ya kazi ya msalaba uligogomelea pale msalabani hatia ambayo ilikuwa imeandikwa kinyume na sisi baba inaomba sasa kupitia kazi ya kaivani madhabao ya kaivani oh lord almighty tukapate ukombozi tukapate ukombozi maisha ya mtu ikaachiliwe maisha ya mtu ikaachiliwe atiba ya mtu ikaachiliwe hear my prayer oh god do what no man can do father 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 hear my prayer Search for your mighty hand. Do what no man can do. Do the supernatural. Do the miraculous, oh God. Surrender to God, somebody. Surrender to God, somebody. Surrender to God. Usikuwe na kiburi mbele za Bwana. Unyenyekee mbele za Bwana. Naye Bwana atakuinua. Usikuwe mtu mwenye kiburi. Nyenyekea kwa Bwana tu. Ufanye ibada mbele za Bwana. Umwambie Bwana nimekukosea. Nimekosea hata kile kipao uliweka ndani yangu. Nimekosea hata ile huduma uliweka ndani yangu. Bwana nimenyenyekea. Wewe ni mwenye huruma. Oh Lord. Shalaba ya ndele masaya. Oh shalaba hana ya ba. Ne bora za kata ya bahani. Zela brahano kataya. Shalaba daba dabi ya dabe. Ela baga dabi ya kataya. Ali kwa dabe. Ne kopi ya kataya. Shale kwa dabi. Me lo peso peketi. Akati ya bahano. Le kwa zika la mi. Empara bataba. Arata dabi. Emose bagadia. Ale kwa dia masande legede. Lord of mercy on me. Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy. Ab mercy oh God. Ab mercy oh God. Mercy, Jesus, 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 show us your mercy now. Shale mahana ya baba. Ukiwa hapo sasa anza kukemea kila roho ambayo iliingia kupitia hicho kitendo uanze kuiambia wewe roho ya shetani unayenyanyasa wewe roho ya shetani uliingia kupitia uzinzi unanitembelea kwa ndoto roi nao leta doto maya inao leta nightmares 
mashetani inaoletwa na hiyo madhabahu ianze kuniachilia roho ya umasikini inaonifuata kupitia hiyo madhabahu ianze kuteketea roho ya manteni roho ya kufilisika roho ya kutukiwa roho ya divorce inaonifuata kwa sababu ya madhabahu the immorality wema roho uanze kuchomeka wema madhabahu uanze kuteketea kwamba hiyo maombi hiyo roho ikiwa ndani ya mtu inaleta maskini inaleta mandeni inaleta watu kuchukiwa anza kukemea ambia hii roho utaniachilia utaniachilia kwa jina la Yesu we roho ya mandeni roho ya ndoto mbaya kuota na ubwa kuota na manyoka we ni roho ya immorality inakukemea tomeka na moto achilia maisha yangu achilia maisha yangu tegetea na moto kemea sasa watu wanaota na ubwa zinawakimbiza wanaota na manyoka wanaota wakikula kwa ndoto wanaota wakifanya mapenzi anza kukemea hizo ndoto ni madhabahu ya uzinzi inafanya kazi kemea kabisa roho hiyo ambayo inafanya unachukiwa na watu hiyo roho ambayo inaleta magonjwa inaleta kisirani ni madhabahu ya uzinzi anza kukemea tunapovunja hiyo madhabahu hiyo madhabahu inaipoivunja maisha ya mtu inabandika pray now hapo nyumbani kemea kabisa hii roho haitakula pesa yangu tena haitakula maisha yangu tena haitauwa kipawa changu haitauwa haitauwa sio kesti mara pa sokotia shale kwa dabaganda era da 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 bush kemea kabisa na roho ya ndoto mbaya na roho ya mateni na roho ya magonjwa kisirani kwa familia kisirani kwa ndoa hiyo inaletwa na hiyo madhabahu anza kukemea anza kuiambia funjika funjika niachilie unakula pesa yangu unaleta umaskini hapa inakuvunja siku ya leo madhabahu ya usinzi immorality authors you must listen my destiny lazima uachilie hatima yangu inakubomboa kwa jina la Yesu inakuvunja inakuja kinyume na wewe kwa damu ya Yesu Kristo inachoma inachoma ya maro inachoma ya maro inachoma kabisa choma pray karabahana ya bagani zekala bagadia meso paragadia Shala bada 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 boja le kwasi kata ya bagande etala bagapia meso paragada gadi Shaba baba 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 Kuna kitu kinatendeka Oh my god Kuna maisha ya mtu inabadilika leo Nasema kuna maisha ya mtu inabadilika leo Na hizi katika anga ya kiro ya kwamba maisha ya mtu inabadilika. Kuna madhabahu inaachilia tajiri. Kuna matajiri wameshikwa. Wanaachiliwa leo hii. Kuna wanabiashara wakubwa wameshikwa na hii madhabahu. Wanaachiliwa leo hii. Naona kwa anga wahubiri wakubwa ambao wamekamatwa na hizo madhabahu. Endelea kuomba. Kuna wahubiri wanafunguliwa. Nasema kuna wanabiashara wanakombolewa saa hii. Hiyo madhabahu inaanza kupasuka. Inaanza kuwaka moto. Kuna wahubiri wanaachiliwa wana biashara wakubwa wasomi wakubwa vipao wakubwa zimekamatwa na hiyo madhabahu moto unaanza kutembea inaelekeza moto katika anga hiyo madhabahu imekamata unabii wako inategetea 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 hiyo madhabahu imekamata kipawa chako inaanza kuungua inaanza kuungua imekamata maono yako maono inaachiliwa madhabahu ni hey morality achilia maono achilia maono achilia mhubiri huyu achilia huyu tajiri muachilie mara moja muachilie mara moja kuna mtu anaachiliwa kuna mtu anaachiliwa kuna nabii anaachiliwa kuna mchungaji anaachiliwa kuna mhubiri anaachiliwa sijui yako wapi kipiganie kwa anga kipiganie kwa anga neema inatembea kwa ubiri wanaachiliwa waimbaji wa mataifa aachiliwa na hiyo madhabahu e kuachilia wataachilia wataachilia hiyo hiyo moto moto inawaka wacha itome wacha itome chilia mhubiri achilia mhubiri achilia muimbaji achilia wewe ula pa 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 ole ghost fire ole ghost fire shala bahana ya bagada mala posa kata ya baganda tena kwazi kata ya bagande intala masha kata kata baroso koti ya gada Shala 
It is because of the altar of immorality. Ilifanya Judah akapoteza inheritance ya baba yake. Ilifanya akapoteza firstborn blessing. Uh -huh. So uh -huh. I want you to come closer as we pray these four prayer points. Mungu amesema ameniambia kuna mhubiri wanaachiliwa, kuna biashara wanaachiliwa, kuna wasomi wanaachiliwa, kuna waimbaji wameshikwa kwa sababu ya hicho kitendo. Uh -huh. They have never sung any, any powerful song. Uh -huh. But after these prayers, Amen. whether you are at home or you are in, inside the church, uh -huh. the grace of God is going to come upon you. Amen. You are going to be delivered in Jesus mighty name. Amen. Songea songea hapo kwa madhabahu tuombe haya maombi. Sema my father my God. My father my God. Sema baba yangu na Mungu wangu. Baba yangu na Mungu wangu. Madhabahu ya uzinzi. Madhabahu ya uzinzi. Madhabahu ya immorality. Madhabahu ya immorality. Ilione kamati ya kipawa. Ilione kamati ya kipawa. Inapo ikemea saa hii. Inapo ikemea saa hii. Nikisema fire fire. Nikisema fire fire. Na kiubiri mahubiri yangu yawachiliwe. Mahubiri yangu yawachiliwe. Uimbaji wangu uachiliwe. Uimbaji wangu uachiliwe. Utajiri wangu uachiliwe. Utajiri wangu uachiliwe. Madhabahu ya immorality. Madhabahu ya immorality. Ilione haribia. Atua zangu za kuhubiri Atua zangu za kusoma Atua zangu za maupiashara Wewe madhaba Inapoomba saa hii Chomeka na moto Anza kufunja hiyo madhaba Kila madhaba Ya immorality Walio ni inolia Baba wa mituni Maupiri ya Piashara ya Kipawachango wanawachiliwa wasomi waliokamatwa wanawachiliwa wanabiashara waliokamatwa waimbaji wa kimataifa walinaswa nayo wacha tuwafungue wacha tuwafunguliwe omba ifunguliwe rusha moto hapa wacha waimbaji wa kimataifa wafunguliwe ula baba 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 la 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 hiyo madhaba inakamata moto inakamata moto inaotawanya baraka za watu madhaba ya immorality kuchika wewe kuchika wewe kuchika wewe kuchika Tachilia biashara Tachilia maroja Madapa Ya imorality Kunchika wewe Kunchika wewe Ulipoteza masomo yake Ulikula masomo yake Utayafungua leo hii Ulikula kipawa yake Utafungua leo hii Ukitegetea na moto Ukitegetea na moto Kungua Chomoa Wacha ichomeke Wacha ichomeke Wacha ichomeke Wacha ichomeke Chomeka wewe Chomeka 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 Wewe madhaba Unakula watoto Unakubuncha leo Leo hila sima ubomoke Aukuli mwingine Aukuli vipawa Awa matajiri utachilia Matajiri utachilia Matajiri utachilia Matajiri utachilia Madhaba wewe Unakula matajiri Kawake umasikini hapa Kawake madeni hapa Utachilia wao leo hii Utachilia wao leo hii Tomeka wende Tomeka wende Tomeka wende Toa madaba Kuchika madaba Kuchika madaba Kuchika madaba Kuchika madaba Kuchika madaba Kuchika 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 Madaba Unakula watajiri wewe Kungua ya maramoja Kuchika uachilie Kuchika uachilie Hole go si fire Hole go si fire Hole go si fire Toma moto Toma moto Hiyo madaba Hile kula kipawa Hika kula kipawa Hiyo tunaibunja leo Hiyo tunaibunja leo 
Utafungua 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 Manabi utaachilia Manabi utaachilia Manabi utaachilia Manabi utaachilia We pepo mchafu Ya kupiga mishale Na kushambulia kwa moto Na kushambulia kwa moto Filisika 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 Nasema ufilisike Nasema ufilisike Nasema ufilisike Nasema ufilisike Madapa Achilia maramoja Filisika wende Filisika wende Filisika maramoja Filisika maramoja Utawachilia atima hii Utawachilia ndesene yake Ndesene utawachilia Wanawaki amba Wanaume amba Wanakuja kwa ndoto Tunawakamata leo Tunawakamata leo Wanaume na wanawake Wanao kutembelea Katika ndoto Wacha tuwawe leo Wacha tuwakamate leo Wanawatua kwa koleo Wanawatua kwa koleo Utaachilia mwanaume wewe Utaachilia mwanamuke wewe Utaachilia mwanamuke Na mwanaume utaachilia Mwanaume utaachilia Mwanamuke utaachilia Wewe madhaba Maro Ya kike na kiume Unachomekea hapa leo Unachomekea hapa leo Chomeka wende Chomeka wende Chomeka wende Chomeka Unachilia ye Achilia ye ye Achilia ye ye Achilia ye ye Come out Come out Come out Come out I say come out I say come out I say come out I say come out Come out Maro Inao tembelea watu Katika ndoto Tunaikomolea hapa Tunaichomolea hapa Fungua ye maramoja Fungua ye maramoja Toka na niyake Inao moletea chakula Wanawake wandoto Wanaume wandoto Fungua ye ye Fungua ye ye Leo tunakumalizia hapa Saidia somebody ya Iyo maro Walio kutumia Hailali kwako tena Demonic nightmares Dodo za kutisha Dodo za kima pepo Utatoka saa hii Utatoka saa hii Choma moto Choma moto Wanawaki amba Wanatembea kwa ndoto Wanaume amba Wanatembea kwa ndoto Toka wendo wewe Achilia atima yake wewe Ulishika nyota yake Utaifungua siku ya leo Nasema utaifungulia hapa Fungua mwanaume araka Fungua nabi ya imbe Fungua nyimbo zake Fungua 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 wewe Fungua Ancestral spirits Ancestral spirits Ancestral spirits Fire is on you now Fire is on you now Come on Come out I say 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 out Every strange spirit Roya kigeni Inaangaisha Wauduma Holy Ghost Holy Ghost Holy Ghost Fungua maramoja wewe Chomoka wende wewe Chomoka wende Fungua maramoja Tua sila sako Tua misiko yako hapa Tua misiko yako hapa Tua wende Come out Eh, toka Toka, mulikamata eh Mulikamata eh Mulishika eh Mulishika uyu Uyu mulishika Mulishika eh Eh, mulishika uyu Mulishika eh Mulishika Tunawua na moto Hiyo ndo initangu wa moto Toa, toa ni kile mulilisha Kile mulilisha eh Toa hari, toa raka Toa raka, toa raka Kuna maagano hapa Sama maagano Maagano Ya mashetani Ya mashetani Walio nipatia Walio nipatia Kupitia chakula Kupitia chakula Ina kutapika saa hii Na kutapika saa hii Na kutapika saa hii Na kutapika saa hii Sema fire itoke Fire Kimoni covenant Fire On evil waters Fire You are coming out now Fire Coming out now Fire Toyo maagano Fire Toyo maagano Fire Tume washika ndio hawa Ime chemuka hapa Utafungua Utafungua Fire Toa haraka Fire Toa hiyo nini Hiyo nini Hiyo nini Hii nini muleweka Hii ni kumaisha nini Hii ni kumaisha nini Sema maangano. Maangano. Walio ni ingiza. Walio ni ingiza. Kupitia vya kula. Kupitia cha kula. Ndiyo ni tumikia madhabao zao. Ndiyo ni tumikia madhabao zao. Unavunjika leo. Sinavunjika leo. Hapa kuna kitu hapa. 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 Itatoka tu. Sema itatoka. Itatoka. Sema itatoka tu. Itatoka tu. Sema agano yoyote. Agano yoyote. Walio ni ingiza. Walio ni ingiza. Na madhabao. Na madhaba Ya uzinzi Ya uzinzi Kupitia chakula Kupitia chakula Utatoka Itatoka 
Can I tell you prophetically what happened to this man? Yes. This man cannot marry. Mm -hmm. Me, I don't know him. He cannot marry. Kuna mustiana alishika e. Oho. Amen. Amen. See here, the nulia mustiana mustiana di ali nulia wish. Na angashika yu manaume. Where's your wish? Me si mojui. But in spiritually, I can see what happened. Uh -huh. I decree as I, and I declare. Uh -huh. yes. As he is going to be delivered. Amen. You are also going to be delivered. Amen. Fuja yu mangano. Fuja yu mangano. Fuja. Fuja. Where muli weka nini yapa? Muli fanya nini? Muli fanya uyo nini? Ha? Muli fanya nini? Muli fanya nini? Muli fanya nini? Ha? Nini muli weka hapa? Nini muli weka hapa? Muli weka nini yapa? Muli weka nini ndani yake? Tuli yapa. Muli weka nini ndani yake? Nini muli weka hapa? Hiyo ni moto. Kila kitu hapa ni moto. Uyu si wenu. Mutamfungua leo. Si unaona? Unaona hii. Hii ni roya singu. Unaona? Haya, fungua hii. Fungua. Tua, tua misiku wenu. Tua misiku wenu hapa. Tua, tua. Tua hiyo chakula mulipatia. Tua, tua. Tua haraka. Itapiki hapa. Itapiki hapa. Itapiki hapa. Mpatia moto hapa itapikwe. Faya. Chakula cha maagano. Faya. Maagano ya kutoa. Faya. Mustiana alie mukamata. Faya. Na maroya kiushetani. Faya. Fungua ye maramoja. Faya. Fungua ye maramoja. Faya. Fungua ye maramoja. Faya. Tua hiyo maagano. Faya. Nasema uitoe inche. Faya. Tapika maagano. Faya. Tapika maagano. Faya. Tapika maagano. Faya. Mpatia moto ndio hiyo inatoka. Faya. Wanaume anakombolewa hapa. Faya. Sambole hiyo. Faya. Wacha itoke. Faya. Wacha itoke. Faya. Wacha itoke. Faya. Hiyo maagano. Faya. Walio funga ye nayo. Faya. Naimalizia uweso. Faya. Naimalizia uweso. Faya. Faya. Toka. Faya. Toka. Faya. Toka. Faya. Toka. Faya. Kungwa ya manamoja. Faya. Kungwa ya manamoja. Faya. Hiyo malabao. Faya. Ya uzinsi. Faya. Imorality. Faya. Walio shika ye nayo. Faya. Tunaichemusha na moto. Faya. Naichemusha na moto. Faya. Hiyo chakula. Faya. Naiweka sumu. Faya. Blood of Jesus. 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 Apo imekwama. Blood of Jesus. Tunaikwamua. Yes. Kwa damu ya Yesu. Yes. Kwa damu ya Yesu. Yes. Fungua wende. Fungua. Fungua. Fungua ye. Fungua manaume. Fungua ye. Fungua. Fungua. Huko muliingiza ye tumekuja huko. Fungua ye. Fungua ye. Fungua ye manaoja. Fungua wende. Fungua. Fungua ye. Fungua. Kibia muende. Kibia ni muende. Kibia ni muende. Muna fungua ye. Muna fungua nyota yake ya kuwa. Ina naimu wa mchizas. Atawa na arusi kupa sana wishu. Amen. Amen. Ha fungua ye. Fungua. Sema fungua. Fungua ye. Fungua. Fungua ye. Fungua manawaja. Fungua manawaja. Fungua manawaja. Fungua. Kwanza mkua ngapi hapa. Mkua ngapi. Mkua ngapi hapa. Shenda. He? Shenda. Amu yaenda. Hiyo. Hiyo amuwezi piga hapa. Hiyo tunaijua hiyo. Hakuna mahali mmeenda. Mulikuwa ngapi. Sawa mmeenda mulikuwa ngapi. Mulikuwa ngapi hapa. He? Twelve. Mulikuwa ngapi? Kwa ngapi? Twelve. Muna musumua na nini? Muna musumua na nini? Muna musumua na nini? Nyi wanawake ama wanaume? Ha? Mme changanyika wanawake ni wangapi? Wangapi wanawake? Mulilala na ye? Mulilala na ye? Kwa ndoto? Muna musumbua? Muna musumbua huyu? Sasa muki musumbua ni munini yake mme kamata ya huyu? Mme kamata nini? Mme kamata nyota yake? Na nini ingine? Nini ingine mme shika? Ndoa yake? Sini kwambi? Si lazima. Iyo ndiyo muimu wakua na mtu wanaenza kuona. Amen. 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 Kunaona uju. Uju wa na nyongo wa uju. Uju. Kungea uju wa naito faa. Sina uju kwa nini. Kuna kitu wa kina mnyongo wa uju. Naisa suwe. Amen. Semeni na yama ya buwana. Na yama ya buwana. Ita tutosha. Ita tutosha. Wana wake sita. Wana mtembalea kwa mtu. Exactly. Kile ni mekufulisha. Mime kuambia fanya ibada hiyo kitu ishi, unakiri itaisha, uju, asipo kombolewa, haezi owa, na nyota yake hawezi tumia, kwa sabu, imeenda na hawa watu sita, na hawa ingine sita, kumi na wili. Mime kuambia anza maali, usiseme sina, anza maali ujikomboe, panezu asifiwe. Amen. Hata yesu kama hata kusaidia, hata kama yesu mungu hata kutumia, hata kukuta ukifanya kitu. Amen. Amen. Alikuta Musa akichunga kondo za laban, haka mambia kuja, alikuwa naito nani miu? Jethro, akamambia kuja ni kutume. Alikuta Dawudi akilisha kondoa za baba yake. Alikuta ngidioni akiiba ngano. Wea unapatika na ukifanya nini? Unataka mungu wa kusaidie. Unafanya nini? Diyo mungu wa kusaidie. Alikuta mitumi wanavua samaki. What are you doing? Alikuta wengine wanafanya tax collection. 
We unataka tu ati Mungu akuje akikutafuta. Ni wewe utafute Mungu kwa malabao. Amen. Haleluya. Amen. Itabidi ujifanyie ibada. Haleluya. Amen. Ndio mkono unasema Bwana nipe neema. Bwana nipe. Hizi vitu sio automatic. Hata nikakudanganya. They are not automatic. You must do something. Haleluya. Amen. Yes. Hata nikakuache na hiyo peke yake. Mimi the knowledge we have it. Somebody can rescue himself. Amen. Haleluya. Amen. Sita. Mimi nakuambia ukweli. Hao wanasema wanawake sita na wengine wamejificha hapo ninawaona tu. Ukalifanya kitu na yeye physical ulikalete spiritual bondage. For there to be physical release there must be a physical event. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. For there to be a spiritual ama spiritual bondage there also must be a physical event mm. imeendelea ndio ikahusisha oh. roho ikafanya hicho. Oh. Amen. Tunapomfungua mtu yote ulifungwa na wasichana hata kama ni wangapi? Uh-huh. Wanawake hata kama ni wangapi? Uh-huh. Nyota inarudi saa hii. Amen. Ndoa inarudi saa hii. Amen. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Amen. Haya fungueni ndoa yake, fungueni nyota yake. Nyota mlipeleka wapi? Nyota yake iko wapi? Nyota mlipeleka wapi? Iko wapi? Kuzimu. Iko kuzimu. Ako na nyota ngapi huyu? Nyota ngapi? Nyota zake ni ngapi? Ha? Sita. Hizo nini? Hizo ako na nyota ine. Na muliiba zote. Hata ana moja. Oh, nasa unajua mmeshikwa mateka. Ha? Wanaume sita, wanawake sita, nyota ine mnafungua saa hii na mnafungua ndoa yake katika jina la Yesu. Nazeni kufungua. Hapo kuzimu tumekuja na moto na damu ya Yesu Kristo. Fungua nyota. Fungua nyota. Nipatie moto hapa. Faya. Nyota sita. Inafunguliwa. Nipatie moto. Faya. Kuzimu sio mbali. Faya. Tunakuja in the name of Jesus. Faya. In the name of the Lord. Faya. Fungua nyota zake wewe. Faya. Fungua nyota zake wewe. Faya. Fungua nyota ukiteketea. Fungua nyota zake. Faya. Fungua ya kwanza. Faya. Fungua ya kwanza ukiteketea. Fungua ya kwanza ukiteketea wewe. Fungua ya kwanza ukiteketea. Fungua hata ya pili wewe. Fungua nyota. Fungua nyota. Fungua nyota. Fungua nyota wewe. Fungua nyota. Fungua ya pili haraka. Fungua ya kuolewa na kuoa. Fungua. Fungua biashara wewe. Fungua ya biashara. Fungua ya masomo. Fungua nyota zote. Fungua. Fungua harusi yake. Fungua harusi. Nyota ya ine Fungua 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 mtumishi wa Bwana wewe Fungua na uteketee Kibia uende Kibia mwenda kusibu Wasichana wa ndoto tunawakemea wanaume wa ndoto Kibia muende Kibia One Fire Two Fire Three Fire In the name of Jesus We set you free unconditionally in the name of Jesus Amen Jesus name you are free amka hey yes na kofi nzuri amen ni wana umeona ukweli wa hiyo message nimekufundisha mhm mtu anaweza ibiwa asiwe yeye peke yake kuna watu sasa hapa nyota zao saba hata haziko ziliendanga tu hivyo mhm kila mtu ulifanya na yeye alienda na nyota mhm tutazirudisha amen tutazirudisha amen in the name of jesus amen, amen. Kuja habari yako bro. Tunalia tu mbele. Angalia hivi. How do you feel? Uko sawa. Tofauti ni nini? Ulikuwa unasikiaje mbeleni? Unalala unamko kwa mtoka. Kwani ulikuwa unahitaji? Kwa maji ya mgaso na mkumu choka sana. Ba, uko na ndoa? Ndoa. Mke wangu. Sasa kwa. Yesi. Ulikuwa umetuambia kabla ulikuwa umetuma SMS ukakuambia nitakuja kuondoa. Unachita ndoa. Kuna mtu alikuwa ametuma SMS. No. Umekuja haja kwanza. Hallelujah. 
sasa unaona vile Mungu anafanyanga kazi. Ujumbe unayezaletewa watu wakadhani si yao. Na Mungu akatafuta mtu ambaye ana mchezo. Anatoka mm. from nowhere anakamata. Wacha nikuambie ukweli. Huyu mwanaume Mungu anambadilisha maisha yake kabisa. Amen. Huyu atakuja hapa na ushuhuda ulio hapa. Amen. Umesikia tumesema tu akiwa ajua ajui kile kinaendelea. Akasema huyu hawezi kalisha ngawa. Amen. Sasa amenena mwenyewe akasema ameoa lakini mke ameenda jana. Ah last week. Dia wa kwanza ama kuna mwingine ulikuwa umeoa? Eh hey, wangapi ulikuwa for example umeoa wangapi wakaenda? Ni wawili. Six of them. You see. The equation. Yani, mimi ukikosa kuvunja hii kitu shauri yako. Na maana Mungu tume, tumefundisha na Mungu amedhihirisha sasa. Huyu anasema hapo anakuja kanisani. Mungu tu ndiye amemleta kijake ndio akuja akufungue uone hii kitu simu hivyo unafikiria. It is the truth of the matter. Amen. Wanakuja kwa ndoto sita na ameoa sita. Mhm. You see? but as the lord lived life hata nyota zake sio ine ni sita kila mwanamke alikuwa anachomoka na moja oh. mungu wetu ni mungu wa uregesho the bible says obadia 117 upon mount zion there shall be deliverance holiness and restoration and i pray as a man of god malaika walete baraka amen hao wanawake walienda na nyota zake Aha. hizo nyota tunaziita saa hii amen. pokea nyota zako my brother amen. pokea vitu vyako pokea. mashamba ndoa harusi pokea hata mashamba pokea hata biashara take it in the name of jesus i say receive it wherever you are hata nyumbani pokea kanisani pokea Harisi. pokea manyumba yako Harisi. pokea magari yako Harisi. pokea biashara zako Harisi. pokea ndoa yako Harisi. pokea pesa zako Harisi. pokea mali yako Harisi. in the name of jesus this done in jesus name amen utakuja hapa lini sasa utakuja hapa lini sasa so, ningependa unielezee kama wamekuja tena kwa ndoto naona niambie sasa nimelala awako kuja sasa sasa waliingia hawakuingia day one wote kila mmoja ako na season ile aliingia tunaona sasa tumeanza kuwatoa na watoa sasa tukiwatoa lazima tutakase hii anga yako na ndivyo nasema kutakuwa na ukombozi utakaso na kurekeshewa tunaona sasa tumefanya ukombozi hawatakuja kwa ndoto zako utakuja hapa sasa tutoe zile vitu walikuwa wamekuweka tutatoa 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 alafu tupande baraka alafu utaoa na harusi na hivyo Amen. Sawa sawa. Eh, hey, na naye Mungu ataama akuje kukaanga kwa. Ah watu wako hapa watakuwa anaona Mungu wako anasema kama unaitwa nani? Kama kama ni Alex Mungu amemsaidia. Mimi nitaabudu nita Mungu. Amen. Yaani watakuwa anatafuta Mungu kupitia kwako. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Father I cover my brother with the blood of Jesus and with the mighty power of the Holy Spirit. Kwa ndoto zako hawatakuja tena. Hata ile namba walikuwa natumia kukupigia kwa ndoto tumeitoa sasa tumeweka ndamu ya Yesu Kristo. Tumeweka malaika kona zote za anga yako. Yule Mungu amekuleta hapa akukutanishe na miujiza yako kuanzia leo. Ukiondoka hapa kutana na baraka zako. Huyo mwanamke alienda tumemfungua katika jina la Yesu. Natangaza ya kwamba ndoa yenu itasimama na itaendelea kabisa na Mungu atawainua kutoka utukufu kwenda utukufu mwingine katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Mtakuwa kielelezo. You'll be an example to those who have seen you suffering. They will see you enjoying the blessing of the Lord in the land of the living in the mighty name of Jesus. You are blessed in Jesus name we pray. Amen, amen. 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 God bless you so much. Tukutane kesho. Si kesho naweza kuja. Asubuhi. Sunday. Sawa. Saa mbili tukutane hapa. God bless you so much. Mpe Yesu makofi mazuri. Hallelujah. Sema mimi nakombolewa. Mimi nakombolewa. Madhabao ya immorality. Madhabao ya immorality. Unaniwachilia by fire. Unaniwachilia by fire. Uko hapa unawatanga na watu wanalala na wao kwa ndoto. Mimi nime confess afu. Mimi anaota hiyo ndoto si mara moja hata si mbili hata si kumi I think mia hivi. Kuja hapa tukemea hiyo roho kwa sababu kama hautaikemea itabaki rafiki yako itakuja tu leo leo kwa sababu itasema ulikosa kuni expose. I'm oh. coming. I'm coming to visit you. So songea hapa tuikemee. 
Songea hapa. Uliwahi yota hiyo ndoto. Is kama haijawahi kemewa, haijaenda mahali. Itaendanga tu hivi iseme waita nirudi kule ile sehemu yangu. Oho. Uh-huh. Haya watakatifu simamene tuwaombe. Naosha mikono hapa. Sema Bwana Yesu. Bwana Yesu. Hii pepo Ipepo. wananitumia kwa ndoto wananitumia kwa ndoto kwa sababu ya hiyo madhabahu kwa sababu hiyo madhabahu ya immorality ya immorality inapoikemea saa hii inapoikemea ienda kabisa ienda kabisa isiwaingia kwa maisha yangu isiwaingia kwa roho ya immorality roho ya immorality madhabahu ya immorality madhabahu nyinyi nyote nyinyi nyote na moto hayaanza kusema fire fire enelea hiyo roho inakusumbua kwa ndoto kwa maono inachomeka Wacha itomeke toka uende toka uende tomeka na moto toka wewe toka toka tomeka uende tomeka uende uncha madhabahu hapo ulingililia unawakisha faya unawakisha faya unawakisha faya yule aliituma tunamkamata pia yule aliituma tunashika yeye mateka choma yeye na moto choma yeye na moto Wacha itagete Wacha iende Kemea 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 Wachilie mara moja Wachilie Holy Ghost Hiyo inaenda Hiyo inategetea Wasichana wanaume wandoto moto moto Achilia yeye wewe Unaye mnyonga kwa ndoto Unaye mnyonga Tumeshika wewe mateka Wachawi ambao wanakuja kumwangaisha Olegos Olegos Tomeka Moja achilia Pele achilia Tatu achilia Nne muachilia Tano muachilia Sita teketea Saba enda In the name of Jesus Moja enda wewe Pele teketea Tatu tomeka Nne utaenda Utaachilia muhuduma Utaachilia biashara Utaachilia nyota Tano unaenda wewe Sita teketea Moja madaba Uncha madaba Uncha madaba Uncha madaba Uncha madaba Uncha wewe Mara ya sita wanatoroka Mara ya saba wanaenda 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 Sema enda wewe Achilia mara moja moja Bele Tegetea wewe Uncha madaba wewe Uncha madaba wewe Uncha madaba wewe Enda ukiendanga Mara ya tano Uncha wende kimbia uende achilia yeye mara moja achilia maisha yake achilia nyota yake achilia kipawa chake kuncha madhabahu wewe roho ambaye spirit has burned kill you by fire that's why by fire that's why by fire kimbia uende sema kimbia uende kimbia uende toka uende toka uende toka uende toka 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 ulingilia wapi we We mko ngapi kwanza nyinyi? Nyinyi mko ngapi? Mko ngapi? Mko ngapi? Mko ngapi nyinyi? Mko ngapi? Mko ngapi? Amen are you? Amen are you? Ha? Aya mmeleta nini kwa huyu? Mnaleta nini kwa huyu? We, mnaleta nini kwa huyu? Mnaletanga nini kwa huyu? Ha? Mnaleta nini? Mnaletanga nini kwa huyu? Ha? Mmeiba nini ya huyu? Nini mmeiba? Nini mmeiba kwake? Hiyo ni nini? Hiyo nini sema tusikie? Nyota moja. Nyota moja. Mmeimba nyota moja. Muliiba aje? Muliiba aje? Muliiba na mwana gani hiyo nyota? Muliiba na mwana gani? Muliiba na mwana gani? Hapo. Muliiba aje? Nyota moja muliiba aje? Muliiba na mwana gani? Muliiba aje? Muliiba aje? Iko wapi saa hii hiyo nyota? Iko wapi? Iko wapi? Mko nayo. Mnaitumia kufanya nini? Ha? Mnaitumia kufanya nini? Mnaitumia kufanya nini? Kuwaletea pesa. Ha? Tulie mmoja ya pesa. Kuliba ya pesa. Huyu hana pesa sahi siku hizi? Hayarudisheni. Kila mtu alibiwa nyota ya pesa inarudi saa hii. Amen. Tukifungua ya huyo yako inarudi. Nipatie moto, nipatie moto hapa. Rudisha hiyo nyota haraka. Fungua nyota ya pesa wewe. Fungua nyota ya pesa. 
hata ya biashara wewe Mungu hata ya harusi kubwa Mungu hata ya uimbaji Mungu nyota zake zote Olegosa Kongua Kibia muende kusimu Kibia muende kusimu Ukifungua vunja madhabahu yenu Ujeni madhabahu mliotumia Madhabahu mliotumia Unaivunja Blood of Jesus Inachoma Bele Hato In the name of Jesus What the difference in Jesus name Nyota ya pesa ilienda inarudishwa in Jesus name Amen You are free eh, Funguliwa in Jesus name Funguliwa Hii ni nini kama ni ya maombi Hebu nione computer tuongee mambo ya ndoto hii usiende na hii haina maana na watanga aje na watanga mama mkilala na watanga na wasichana wengi sana wasichana wengi sana eh nilikuwa nasoma na wao unafanya nini unafanya mapenzi unafanya mapenzi unaona hiyo message inatusaidia bana just feel ama ulikuwa umetuambia ukikuja leo tuhubiri hivi hata nilikuwa nilikuwa nimekita tu nilikuwa ninaenda shule hata ulikuwa unaenda shuleni ukasema acha niingie hapa kuna Mungu hapa kuna Mungu hapa amen now ndio watu Mungu atawasaidia amen mpaka next time wakikuja hapa wanakuja na living testimony amen kweni wangapi kweni mimi ni wa 5 watano okay vio na watu na wasichana wengi mnalala na wao kuna au unaona wengi kuna mmoja umewahi fanya hivyo physically mmoja cha ukweli sasa waacha ndoto hapana hakuna mm. lakini kuna siku ulifanya hata kama si yao yeah. mahali pengine sasa hiyo ndio ilifungua mlango unaona yes. na mtu yote unaotanga hiyo ndoto kuna mlango ilifunguka mhm and that's why amen either you want to be ignorant or you want to assume lakini the best thing you can do to deliver yourself from that So, hiyo ni Paulo amesema mtu yote anayefanya uzinzi anafanya dhambi kinyume na mwili wake mwenyewe kwa hivyo hiyo ni hiyo mwili sasa uisukume mm-hmm. tena uipeleke kwa madhabao ifanye ibada mm-hmm. amen amen deliverance hii tunafanyanga ni ya nini ukiokoka utaenda mbinguni lakini ukosa kufunguliwa hapa duniani utalia utahangaika mm-hmm. maana hizo zikiwa ndani yako zinatawanya baraka Mhm. Anaweza sifiwe? Ndio unaona huyu jamaa hata akang'ang'ana aje. Hata akajaribu nini? Hakuna kitu anaweza weka. Huyu hata mpatie 1000 saa hii. Na kesho muulize balance hata kuonyesha kitu. Anakaa ni kama ako na ile funnel ya kuweka mafuta ta. Inakuanga hapa juu ni kubwa na kale kingine ni kadogo. Sasa ya huyu ni tofauti. Yake imeweka upside down. Kale kadogo ndio kanaingiza ile ya kutoa ndio kubwa. Mhm. Unaelewa kile anajaribu kusema? unapatanga vitu kwa ungumu sana lakini zinapotea kwa urais. Yes. Si ni kweli? Eh, yeah, hiyo ni kweli. Na hapo ametuambia ame lakini prophetically we can see the spirit behind what is happening in this life but after this service. Amen. After these prayers. Amen. Amen. Mungu atakutumia. Amen. Utakalisha baraka. Amen. Familia yenu utakuwa wa kwanza ku make it in life. Amen. Hata kama kuna watu unaona ni kama wameendelea. Hiyo ni dalili ya kuendelea. Aha. Wewe ndiyo utaendelea. Amen. Na kila kamba za kifamilia. Aha. Maro iliyosema watu wa kwenu hataenda mahali. Inakuachilia saa hii kwa moto. Hiyo wasichana wanatawanya vitu vyako. Kupitia hiyo madhabahu ya immorality. Tunaivunja kwa moto. Tunaiteketeza na moto. Tunafungua nyota yako. Bye. Masomo yako Bye. milango ya kuendelea Bye. in the mighty name of Jesus Amen and I pray for you in the name of Jesus you are going to have an an issue of favor an issue of favor ni kibali kisio cha kawaida 
Kuna watu utakutana wao watakufungulia milango mioyo yao utashangaa huyu mtu ameona nini ndani yangu kuna kitu ya Mungu imeingia ndani yako utapendwa na watu ambao huko fikiria kama watakupenda na watakusaidia my brother utaenda mbali utakuja hapa hii kanisa siku moja vile tu umekuja leo by surprise utakuja tena hapa na ushuhuda ulio hai na kwamba Mungu amenisaidia nimepenya kwa masomo nimepata kazi kubwa in the name of Jesus receive it now pokea pokea kazi yako pokea hao watu nimewatuma kwa anga yako kwa upako wa mafuta katika jina la Yesu Kristo utakuja hapa na ushuhuda in Jesus mighty name amen and amen god bless you so much in Jesus name amen hawatakuja tena kwa ndoto zako amen amen Amen. Say my father my God. My, my father, father my every God. Covenant, every covenant. Every covenant of sexual immorality. Of sexual immorality. As I shout fire. As as I I shout let fire. it break by fire. Let, let it, it break by fire. Hiyo ndio maombia mwisho wale tuko pale nisaidie nione nani yako online. Hiyo ndio maombia mwisho alafu kesho saa 3. Mtumishi wa Mungu atakuwa hapa na huruma kama timu ya Yuda. Mambo makubwa yatakuwa yanatendeka. Hallelujah. Amen. God bless you Ernest kwa sababu ya sadaka yako. Neema ya Bwana ikuwe juu yako katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Madhabao ya immorality is way locate wewe. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Oh the sound is oh kuna wakati sound ilikuwa na tatizo. Thank you so much for your feedback you guys. You are helping us so much. So Mungu abariki sana. Kesho tutakuwa hapa na ibada na mtumishi wa Mungu Professor of Deliverance. The overseer himself the mzozo sisi ni wana wa mzozo sasa mzozo yenyewe itakuwa hapa kesho kuanzia saa tatu. kama una uwezo wa kusafiri ukuje hapa please come this is a church for everybody is a worldwide church mm-hmm. that's why we can come to your house we preach for you and we deliver you when you are there so nataka niombe watu wawili watatu purity na kuombea katika jina la Yesu Kristo nyosha mkono hapo kwa screen naombea wale wako nyumbani in the name of Jesus Nyinyi maroa mnaotembelea huyu msichana anaitwa Purity katika ndoto zake. Mnakuja kutawanya vitu vyake. Mnaleta kukosana na watu. Maana inaona Purity uko na roho inakufanya ukosane na watu. Na ni hiyo mashetani. Ni hiyo maroa imepitia kwa madhabahu ya immorality. Hiyo maroa inafanya ukosane na watu. Inakuachilia saa hii. Inakuachilia saa hii. Inakuachilia saa hii. Hapo ulipo funguliwa. Funguliwa na tuma moto. Na choma hiyo maroa. Eh hey, chomeka, chomeka, chomeka. Muachilie. Muachilie maroa. Come out in the name of Jesus. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Funguliwa purity. Ndio hii inaenda. Achilie yeye. Enda kuzimu. Enda kuzimu. Fungua. One, two, three. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. You are free. In the name of Jesus. Hakuna kukosana na watu tena. And I prophesy in the name of Jesus. Good people are coming in your life in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Who else is online? We need to pray for you. May the grace of God be upon you in Jesus name. Stand like you know. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. Every spirit of error. Spirit of error unakosanga unafanyanga terrible mistakes. Na unapokumbuka ya kwamba umefanya mistake the mistake cannot be corrected. Ni roho inatumia hiyo madhabahu. But as I'm praying for you that demon is coming out of your life na hiyo madhabahu inavunjika spirit of error in the name of Jesus. Lose my brother. Lose my brother. Lose him now. Toka mara moja inakupiga mishale ya moto. Tawanyika. 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 Tawanyika mwachilie. Out. One mwachilie. Two mwachilie. Three mwachilie in the name of Jesus. Inakuombea katika jina la Yesu. Pokea sober mind. Hakuna mistakes tena utafanya katika maisha yako. Your life is blessed. Hii mwaka you will be celebrated in Jesus mighty name. Amen. Amen and amen. God bless you so much. Kama kuna kitu umekuombea na unasema kabisa mtumishi wa Mungu umeomba right. Confirm. Na Mungu wa mbinguni akubariki sana. Nilikuwa nasema tunaomba hii maombi ya mwisho. Covenants. Covenants. You might have ended consciously or unconsciously. Na mtu kupitia madhabahu ya immorality I want us to challenge those covenants. Now, kabla tumaliza ibada, ufikirie tena na tena. Utafanya hiyo ibada ama utawacha hiyo story hapa? Amen. Amen. Kila ninajua ni kwamba kuna mtu hii message itamsaidia. Anaweza kuja kuangalia hii message 2092. Lakini aseme this is what has been troubling me. Aseme now my life will never be the same again. Amen. Fanyia hiyo kitu ibada. Hiyo kitu mlifanya it was an service ndio maana hapo kando kulikuwa na ndimu zinawaambia ehe endelea endelea mapepo ilikuwa hapo inasema endelea sasa lazima uhusishe malaika waseme funguliwa 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 amen haleluya amen. 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 amen amen hapo kwa nyumbani na hapo kanzani inua mikono yako juu sema my father my god my, my father, father my god every immoral covenant 
every immoral covenant, covenant of immorality covenant of that immorality. I have ever met that I have ever met consciously or unconsciously consciously or unconsciously as I shout fire as I shout fire. seven times seven times let it be broken let it be broken can I hear you shouting fire fire every covenant fire of immorality fire holding my destiny fire holding my star fire holding your destiny fire holding your star fire immorality covenant fire wherever you are fire be destroyed now Fire. Break my fire. fire! Break my fire! fire. Break my fire. fire! Break my fire! fire! Break my fire! fire! Break my fire! fire! Let your destiny fire. be released now. Fire. Let your star fire. be delivered now. Fire. Financial star, fire. ministry star, fire. marriage star, fire. career star. Fire. Wherever your star has been held, fire. it has been released by fire. fire. Shout fire! Fire! fire. fire. Fire! 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 Sato, Satatu. Please make sure you come. If you can travel and join the man of God, Tunakukaribisha kwa niyabe ya mtumishu wa mungu. It is an operation, altar versus altars. We are going deeper day by day. Leo tumenguza hapo. Kesho na amini kuna mahali, tuapitishwa ifi. Ata we mwenye utasimama useme kwa hakika. Madhabao, ndio uwe na misu. Nae mungu atakubariki, mungu atakutumie. Mahali popote utaenda, mekueka chapa ya baraka. Chapa ya kipendeleo. Chapa ya kupenya Chapa ya ushindi Katika jina la Yesu Christ Upendwe ata na watu wasio kujua Na inakuambia within 24 hours People you never knew To come and bless you in Jesus mighty name Amen. I send people by the anointing on this altar Prophetic anointing which is operating very powerfully Amen. Inakuambia chini ya masaa ishina maine oh. Ubarikiwe na watu usio wajua Amen. Watu amba huku fikiria wanaeza wakabariki wewe Ni matuma kwa maisha yako. Amen. Hapa kanisani na nyumbani. Amen. Receive them in Jesus name. I receive them. Amen and amen. God bless amen. you so much. Kumbuka ni kesho. Ukikaa ufikirie kufanya hiyo ibada. Namba ya simu ndio hiyo 0723365099. God bless you so much. We love you. Thank you so much for being part of our service today. Let amen. us share the grace tunapotoka kwa ibada. And now may the grace of our Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ and, and the, the love, love of God, God. And, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, Spirit be with us now and, and forevermore. Amen, amen and amen. amen. God bless you so much. Till we meet again tomorrow. Amen. Bye bye. Let's appreciate them once again. Hallelujah.